All right. Yeah, yeah, I think. I think that's about right. Hey. 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 I'm sorry. I look, I I that wasn't my that wasn't my fault. That wasn't my fault. I only missed it by like an inch. That wasn't my fault. Okay. Hey. What the? What? Wow, I've never seen that before. The little heart icon joined with chat this time. You guys are here. How does it feel? Huh. An inch is a lot for some people. I agree. I, To be honest with you, I feel like an inch is, um, an inch is actually a lot bigger than most people actually think. Hi. I hope I hope you're having a nice day. Hmm. Honestly, honestly, I've got this thing on my mind, and I just can't get it off. And I want to tell somebody about it, but I just can't. It's really bringing me down, man. It's really bringing me down. It's really bringing me down. It's tearing me up from the inside. I just don't know what to do. <sighs> this time it's not good news. In fact, it's bad news. In fact, it's possibly the worst news that I could share with anyone. That's why I'm not sharing it. I'm still playing Suica. And I fucking hate this game. I play it every day. I play it every day. And it's tearing me apart. Every single time, I jump back in. I jump back in and I, I just don't know what to do with myself. It's just just the fucking cherries, man. The strawberries and and and, and the melons. So many melons. Every single time. Every single time something turns into something else. There's a smaller fruit that gets under it. And I just don't know what to do. Again and again and again. It never stops. Oh, you have you have you have a you have an orange, then you then you have an apple, then you have then you have a, a melon, then you have then you have a pineapple. No, no, then you have a peach, then a pineapple, and then and then a fucking and then a fucking like rock melon or some shit. And then you and then you have and then you have a watermelon. And every time it goes to a bigger melon, there's a smaller fruit that just sneaks under there. And I'm just like, what am I doing wrong? I can't figure it out. I can't fucking figure it out. I just don't know what to do. So, I've played this game. I've decided to play this game, Little Misfortune, today. Because I want to know if somehow there's someone more unfortunate than me. My gotcha luck is shit. My Suica luck is shit. So I wonder if somehow Little Misfortune's luck will some way somehow be worse than mine. I simply wanted to experience the story of a kindred spirit. So here I am today, playing Little Misfortune. Abuki, thank you for one month. <laughs> I'm glad the workout vod did well for you, Wish. Thank you for the super. Yeah, no, it's a problem. It's a problem. It's a problem, Crow. Thank you for one month, though. Excited to see you play one of your games. Enjoy the playthrough. Also, why do cows have hooves instead of feet? Because they lack toes. <laughs> they lack toes. <laughs> I, can't, <laughs> I can't even smile. <laughs> I'm, not a, I'm not a better man for this experience. No matter what score I come out with on top of all this, no matter how much grinding I do, no score will ever make it feel worth it. Never will I be satisfied by this escapade. 
I'm a worse man for this experience. I will not be better. I will not be better. I will never recover from this. I will die. Macy, thank you for two months. <gasps> Christy, have a, have a good rest. Thank you for one month. Adia, welcome to the Vanta crew. What do you call a divorce cookie? A misfortune cookie. <laughs> a misfortune cookie. You get it because regular cookies are called fortune cookies. <laughs> Melon! Sarka! <laughs> okay. Alright, we can ball. Is this loud? Is this loud at all? <laughs> you got all the combatants by yourself and you got bested by a comfy game, Sag. This is not a comfy game. Fuck that. You can't lie to me. You can't fool me. That's not a comfy game. This is gonna be more comfy than fucking Suica. Alright. This is not loud? Okay, fantastic. What about this? Oh wait, no. I didn't change the volume at all. Have fun with Little Misfortune. It's such a such a special little game, Crochet. Yikes forever. Yikes forever. Yikes forever. Is that a reference? That must be a reference. Benton, if you want to feel better, I'll show you my suite of progress and you will feel so much better. <laughs> I can assure you I won't. I can assure you. That's a bold statement. I'm gonna be real with you. I don't even listen to the BGM anymore when I'm playing the game. I just listen to Screamo. I listen to I listen to Perfect Weapon by the Black by the Black uh, Veil Brides. When I'm uh, when I'm playing Suica. I'm just like, I'm just dropping the fruit. Here's to your perfect weapon. Black bones with blind aggression. Like birds whose wings are broken. I just, I just want to die, bro. I just want to fucking die. Literally, the, this story, it's just illustrating my life. You live without direction. The song is calling me out. Thank you for the supas. Thermos, thank you for two months. <sighs> oh, thank you. I, I'm gonna do my best, Alpaca. Thank you for the super, though. <laughs> oh my gosh. <sighs> Literally, this song is me. And then when I accidentally drop a fruit in the wrong place, or when a fruit gets sent flying over to another corner that I didn't intend it to, I just scream. I just. Aah! I just. I don't know what to do, dude. Okay. All right, we ball. So this isn't loud. You said this isn't loud. How loud is it? Like, is it is it serviceable? Is it loud enough? How is it? Should I? It, does it matter if I play on gamepad or keyboard? Does it make a difference? It's clicky, it's fine. Okay, so the sound is fine. It's doable. Okay. What about V-Sync? Is V-Sync gonna be, gonna, gonna be a bitch this time? Or is this- this game isn't very demanding, is it? Fruit's giving him a hard time ever since he had our fruits. He said our fruits were fake during the stream. He said thank you for- thank you for one month. You were right, honestly. There's a few trigger warnings. Oh, is there? Oh, okay. Well, take care. I don't partic- I don't have any trigger warnings to- to, to tell home about, so. I'm chilling. Honestly, uh, at this point, my only trigger warning is watermelon. Suica. That's all. Every time I scroll down and see that shit on Twitter, I just see all, I just see my gen mates fighting with all the senpai over it. Your score is higher! Your score is higher! Meanwhile, I'm just scraping at the bottom of the fucking barrel, dude. That's my fucking trigger warning. Take care, y'all. You guys probably know more about this game than I do. Alright, everything looks fine. Extras, cinematics, nothing's changed. Alright, we ball, baby. 
What's my high score so far? I'd rather not tell you. When I get a score that I'm proud of, I'll tell you my score. Right now, I'm not proud of my score. I'll just tell you this. It's higher than what I had before. Like, a fair bit higher. But I'm not going to say what it is. So don't update my position in the leaderboards. Personally, I don't give a flying fuck. I need to score for myself. That's why I don't stream that fucking game anymore. New game. What the heck? Oh, goodbye, Kurokoko. I never said bye to you, homie. See you later. I don't care about beating my wave mates. I don't care about beating anybody. I just want to beat myself. Fuck, that sounded wrong. Is that... is that a tombstone? Oh, it's a portal. Wait, what did the high fox have to do with anything? The rules of this game are simple. Play it until the end, and you'll be rewarded. Okay, then. We ball. She's a wonderful child oh. from a not so wonderful family. She's not speaking English. A little sparkle for you. Oh fuck! Now she's and a little speaking sparkle English. For you and a little bit for me. <laughs> oh, the sad part is. What's the sad today part? is the day she will die. What the fuck? Huh? I can hear you, you know. What? Oh, you can. Wait, what? <laughs> Are you inside my head or something? Hmm... Well... Okay. Yes. <laughs> Alright. I'll call you... Mr. Voice. Okay. What did you say about me dying today? Die? No. Nobody said anything about anyone dying today. Wow, you fucking liar. Uh, nobody said nothing? You know, I have prepared a game for you. Uh. A game? Really? For me? If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. You dark motherfucker! Eternal happiness? I guess I could give that to my mommy. Okay, it's a deal. Bro, what? Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to play? Yes. Your first mission is to leave the house. Bro, what? Okay. I'm gonna do it. Is eternal happiness supposed to be death? Oh, can I only go left and right? Okay. What did I just do? Oh, am I changing my clothes? Look, this is my secret hiding spot. Oh, oh. impressive. What? But why do you need a hiding spot? I don't like it when mommy and daddy argue too much. Oh. And when I come here, I can dream and travel far away. I see. <laughs> Wait. 
What? Wait, is that is is that just her room or is that her entire house? This is Bobsy, the guardian of the secret spot. You see his eye? He got that from a battle against a monster. A monster? That sounds scary. It was. Where? Wait, where? How could she hide? What? Oh God, what's going this is on? This diary. Nobody is allowed to read it. Want to see? I like to play with my toys. I like to talk to them because it's fun. Hello, diary. At school... Oh, the fox! What? At school I drew, and at home... At school I drew, and at home I was at my hiding spot talking to Bubsy, and I heard it. I saw a fox walking outside my room. He's called Benjamin, I think. <laughs> Benjamin. Ugh. Benjamin. Fox. Yes. <laughs> Wait, so Mr. Voice knows about the fox? Hello, diary. My dad lied to me again. Not going out to the park today. I made myself pretty, but he doesn't care. I feel sad. I cried, but told mommy I'm okay. I'm afraid if I tell her I'm sad, she'll be angry. Oh, oh, what the? Sometimes I don't know how to feel. Nobody's teaching me how to feel. I wish in school they'd teach us where feelings come from, but for reals, no fairy tales. Bruh, what? Oh, yikes forever. Oh, yikes forever. Oh, yikes forever. Wait, this is so sad. Hello, diary. Is it okay to have feelings for a fox? Wah. <laughs> the puke of love. That's what it is. You know, relatable. Ben Benjamin, the fox, came to visit when I was playing outside. And we looked at each other and my heart felt warm. And like, if I was about to vomit, but in a good way. Then he ran away because my mommy shouted that dinner was ready. Hello, diary. My daddy hit mommy. Whoa, 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 is that supposed to be no- Whoa, should I hit people I love? It doesn't feel right. Daddy can't see he's hurting me too when he hits mommy. I will prom- I promise I will never be like my daddy. I played today, and I took a plane to Japan and saw interesting things. I know about Japan because my friend is Japanese. He likes sushi. Whoa. A Japanese friend speaks Japanese. That's very problematic when we want to talk. It's hard to understand each other. It's confusing, but I like him. He has a pair of sweet boots and a cowboy hat. His name is Hiro, and he's a ghost. I drew him a picture, but I never gave it to him. Wait, huh? He's a ghost? That's Hiro, my Japanese friend. What? He's a ghost. Okay, maybe this is just me. When she said that's very problematic, I instantly got terrified. But then she said that when we went to talk, it fixed it for me. Later. I love my glitter. Hello, diary. Look, I have a glitter from school. It's super shiny, and we use it to make Christmas cards. I think Christmas cards are pretty, but I don't believe Santa's for reals. If a man could give everyone a gift, why can't he give poor people water and food? Ah, oh, I saw a TV show with people from other countries having nothing to eat. Anyway, I don't believe Santa's real, but the glitter is amazing. It makes me think that all that makes me sad and angry can be sprinkled with sparkle to look prettier. This makes me a little less sad. What? <sighs> you better have a lot of fun with these parents in hell, chat devil. Thank you. Hello, diary. I went picking tomatoes with my grandma. It's not so nice. I saw butterflies, some other insects too. I ate two tomatoes and then I was stuffed. You made a real nice drawing there. You see? It's yeah. so cute. Very nice. It is. Hello, Thank diary. You coloring too. Impressive. Oh, I was riding my tricycle. You know what, buddy? For the bicycle, it looked straight in the sun and I started crying because it hurt my eyes. I always said that one should not look directly at it. Hello, diary. It was fun today because I was at the lake and I saw birds flying and also fish in the water. I felt like warm water uh, came near my bottom. I fit in the lake. It was really warm. Damn, okay. Uh, fuck. That was, that was neat. I didn't have to actually know that. Hello, Diary. How are you? I'm good to, I'm good too. I have to do homework, but I can't stop thinking about Benjamin. I found a picture of me when I was younger. Time goes by fast. He looks yummy. Ha. Very cute. Halloween costume ideas. I'm a little lady. That's what I am. Holy, little lady fox. Wah. Holy shit. I love my coloring book. Whoa. 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 Shit just got real. Hmm. Hmm. For Bubsy.
Oh man, wait, I shouldn't have played this dude. But I fuck. I should have known there would be choices in this game. I'm terrible at these. Most games that involve choices, I can't pick. I'm bad at these, bro. I can't stream them. I gotta leave it or take it. Alright, I'ma take it. I'm gonna take it with me if I get bored, okay? Okay. Okay. I like it. This is my diary. Wait, wait. No. We already read it. This is Bobsy. You see his eye? A monster? Oh, okay. It was. Okay, back. There we go. Oh, jeez. Oh, Benjamin. Look, I drew this picture. It's the fox I see outside my window sometimes. I call him Benjamin. He's a really cute fox. Ugh. I don't care much for foxes. Wait. Benjamin was, like, given a task or something. And then he... He, like, lit up what seemed like a tombstone. And apparently this little girl sees... Sees him all the time. Mm. And then the voice, Mr. Voice, mentioned how she was gonna die. Mm. Mm. Who's the fox? Who's the fox? I wonder. I like to move my body. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's the music that goes on forever. Who's Mr. Fox? <laughs> Look, I made these paper dolls myself. This is Kimberly and this is Steven. They're on a trip fighting super evils. Nice. I saw a monster in here once. In your closet? I it the finger and it never came back. Oh, this is her room. <laughs> I delayed her. Oh, nice. Sick. Throw glitter with F? Oh, cool. Is there anything else I can get here? <laughs> Is there anything else? I think I, I think I grabbed everything. All right, I'm vibing. Let's head out. Before you leave, which toy do you choose to bring with you? Fuck. Can I take them both? No, you can only choose one. Are you for real? Remember. Your choice is much more important. Oh my god. Why would you say okay. that? I choose. Okay. So, the unicorn would be for mental health, and the stone would be for physical health. Both of which are intrinsically linked. And if she's gonna die, that means that she might be in imminent danger. So if I'm trying to prevent that, then we might have to fuck some bitches up. We're, we're taking that stone. I choose the stone that he threw at me once. Oh my god! I call him Stony. You kept the stone! stone. Get it? <laughs> uh... Stony, the stone. That's very clever. Thank you. <laughs> Oh no! There's <laughs> What the f What the heck? Ah, and so you know, I like to sprinkle sparkle on things so they become fabulous. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> happiness to everything! Oh, yeah, happiness to everything. On the other side of the screen. Yeah, what's up, homie? Remember I told you she was going to die today. Yeah. Let's keep that a secret between us, all right? You make it seem like I can talk to her. Oh, <gasps> it's Benjamin! Bro, this is terrifying. Grandma? This is Grandma. She wears a diaper, too. <laughs> you oh. still wear a diaper? Nah, that was so last year. <laughs> <laughs> Here that way. Mommy likes to collect glasses. I broke a couple ones by running too fast. Did mommy find out who did it? Hmm? No, but I had a piece of glass in my foot for like five days. Bro, what? <laughs> oh my god, I. Oh fuck, dude. 
No! I... I didn't want to run. The game made me do that. No! It's all broken now. That was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Please don't tell on me. Don't worry. You can trust me. Okay, thank you. Hmm, maybe I could try to fix it. Ah. Uh. Fix it? I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, I can just... Okay. Fuck. To fix it. Did I not do it? Wait. I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. What? What did I do? What the fuck? Oh, the fucking flower? You're joking. You're joking, right? Wait, are they in different pieces now? This is some bullshit. No, they're not in different pieces. Son of a bitch, dude. I didn't even notice the, I didn't even realize the flower. All right, we take those. Wait. All right, we ball. I did it. I did it. Oh. Look, that's me. Mommy told me I have to smile, even when I'm sad. Damn. Oh. My daddy's friend was a hunter and killed this moose. His daughter, Erica, she thought his gun <gasps> was a toy. No. She said bang bang to her mommy and daddy. Then her parents died, and she was so sad. <laughs> oh. The fuck? Do I even want to know what? Mommy said she married daddy because she was expecting me. She wanted to have an abortion. Ah. It's illegal and against the law. Ah. It's kind of the same thing. Oh my fuck. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Holy shit. I, I it's, it's like. It's like the way she delivers it makes me want to laugh, but then I remember what I'm laughing at, and I... I'm never gonna be okay. Ugh, it smells like cigarettes in here. Yeah, that's my mommy. She also likes to drink juice a lot. <laughs> well, are you ready to complete your first mission? <laughs> yes, I am. I'm gonna get that prize. Okay, what prize? Uh, when will daddy and Lerna like them alive? What? Why are they in the fridge? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Mommy, this smells really bad. What is it? Dead animals. That's what it is. Ah! Yikes forever. Yikes forever, dude. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. We had a lovely dinner last night. Mommy wasn't that drunk and daddy actually said hi to me. 
Oh. Oh, shit. When I grow up, I want to be just like my mommy. A juice drinker. Uh. Yeah, yeah, she got juice. That's that's what it is. You're you're right. When I grow up, I want mm -hmm. to be just like my mommy. Yep. A juice drinker. Just just not not the kind of juice she's drinking. Different juice. That's today. Wait. What? Is that for real? Do they make the dates match? That's kind of neat. Did the dates match? Is it like online or something and it connects? Oh no, it's just a coincidence? Oh. Oh, that's kind of cool. Wow. <laughs> it's October 11th, baby. That's kind of neat. That's kind of crazy. I'm Vantacro coincidence. Tell mommy you're leaving? Hmm. Okay. Hmm. So here's the thing. Usually it's a good idea to tell people that you're leaving and where you're going so that they know where you were at last if you don't come back home. But in this case, do we want to tell her that we're leaving? I feel like I should regardless. Because she's been taking care of us up to now, even if taking care of quote unquote is kind of questionable. So yeah, like I feel like that's a no-brainer. I'm going out to play, mommy. <laughs> Crazy Dio, dude. Sweet Cerise, thank Good you for the morning. member. Welcome to the Vanta Crew. It's afternoon, Miss Fortune. Good day, morning. Uh, okay. Good afternoon, morning. All right, where are we going? Remember Benjamin the Fox? Yeah. This is where I first saw him. Oh, really? He was hiding in the trash, and we made eye contact. It was really intense. Yes, you've told me about that fox already. You shouldn't trust the fox. They're all criminals. What? A fox mm. criminal? <laughs> That's silly. Okay, so here's my first here's my first tinfoil hat theory. The fox is actually death or a messenger slash uh I don't know. A messenger slash like I guess spokesperson for death. And the fox was actually supposed to take out was actually supposed to take was supposed to take her out a while ago. But but he failed to. He probably fell in love with her too. Or he felt sorry for her. That's why the voice doesn't like him. Like a Grim Reaper. Yeah, sort of like a Grim Reaper. But rather than actually being death himself, I don't know. It's hard to believe a fox would, would be death. So some kind of representation of death rather than being, you know, the Grim Reaper himself. This bowl smells like a toilet. <laughs> because I pee on it. <laughs> That is disgusting. Yeah, what the Not fuck? Not as disgusting as when my daddy puked in it. That was disgusting. <laughs> Bro? This is where daddy often sleeps. Daddy? I'm always gonna make theories about stuff, even if I don't have all the information, because I find it fun. Kitty. Kitty, don't go. <gasps> Damn it. I never get to pet Whoa. animals. Whoa. Whoa. You need to watch your language, young lady. So, before we continue, you need to know the rules of the game, Miss Fortune. Okay. All right. Remember, you will be given choices on your journey. Okay, Susan. There is no right or wrong. Only consequences. Okay, okay. Only consequences. Uh -huh. When you beat the game, the prize of eternal happiness is yours. 
I'm ready. Your next mission is to cross this road. All right, I can do that. Huh. Look to the left, look to the right. Any course? No. Okay, I'm going. We run. Holy shit. Whoa. I saw a monster. What monster? I didn't see anything. Hey, yo, fuck you, Mr. Voice. It's probably just your imagination. Yeah, that's true. I have a very big one. Just keep going. We'll have so much fun. All right. <laughs> Look, a sleepy bird. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's go now. Okay. Can I go over here? Okay, so she she, she shoots it away. Oh. Look. Oh. A sleepy same thing. Bird. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's go now. Fanta crew cameo. Renly, thank you for the member. Welcome to the Venta crew. Venta crew, hey, Yokoso. Oh. Oh. Oh, she hasn't. She has her own OP. Pog. Oh. Oh. So she brings misfortune to all those around her? Oh shit. Wait, what? Maybe she's Satan. Is that what it is? Huh, I used a little sparkle back there. Anyway, where are we? Where are we? Where indeed? Look, there's a puppy. Hello, puppy. What a cute party hat. Now focus, Miss Fortune. Uh -huh. You have to make a very difficult choice regarding this puppy now. Be aware of the consequences. Yeah. All right. Play with it or set it free? Fuck. Mm, okay, so... Okay. Okay. So, two options. Play with it or set it free. So, considering this dog's got a party hat on, it was either its birthday or it participated in a birthday. Meaning, it was definitely left here by mistake. And the owner will probably come back at any point. So setting it free is most definitely not the correct option. So simply by, by, by process of elimination, we can assume that play with it is the correct answer. There's no there's no way setting it free is a good idea. There's no way. Because we don't know where it's going to go. We, we don't even know if it knows the way home. We don't know what way home is. So, we should play with it. I will play with it so we can share a nice time together. Good choice. Now, throw <sighs> the ball at it. What ball? This ball. Ah, that ball. Okay. <laughs> mm. Oh. <laughs> that wasn't funny. Whoa! No! What did I do? It's all broken. No! Everything I touch breaks. What's wrong with me? There's nothing wrong with you. Sometimes life is just unfair. No! I'm here for you. Really? Thank you. Well, sadly, the puppy will miss the party now. What party? The owner of this dog, George. No! I think you have to go and tell him. No! What accident? Ah, uh, yes, the puppy, yes. Let's go. 
It's just a bit farther ahead. All right. Hey, oh, fuck you, Mr. Narrator. You're a bitch. Uh, red Bull Bobby Killer. Vanta, how could you do this? Shut the flying fuck up. I'll fuck all of you up. Every single one of you. Say that shit again. I'm I dare you. I broke you, Bobby. I really am. Maybe we can play later. You know? When I'm broken, too. Yang, Noji, thank you for the member. <laughs> I'll take the party hut as a symbol of our friendship, Puppy Doggy. Who do you think this is? Damn it. Thank you for the super. Fuck, Except dude. No dogs allowed. Oh, really? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh, I step on Doogie Doo. Oh. <laughs> Bro? I can only walk forward. Are you just gonna step in it? Ah! Oh. Let's see what came out. What? I see a lot of glitter and. This is that rice pudding? What? I can't watch this anymore. Please, let's keep moving. Oh my god. Why why is she eating glitter? What's going on? Bro, okay, okay, okay. Everything she touches, everything that's around her experiences misfortune. So, if I ever have a choice like that again, let it go. Let it fucking go. I'm like Elsa now. That sign doesn't work. Do you see all the crap flying around? That's a good observation, <sighs> Miss Fortune. <laughs> thank you. Oh, fuck you. Thank you for the five gifts. And thank so, you so much. Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer to the prize of eternal happiness. And the party, right? Ah, yes. That too. The party. Uh-huh. You know, once at this lake, I got my head stuck in a plastic bag. Uh -huh. I remember falling asleep and waking up in the hospital. What? That's terrible. Yeah, I almost died. Bro! What is this? Uh, Vanta crew! Oh my... Guys! This is you! This isn't me! I don't condone this shit! Uh, That's y'all! I think you're in big trouble, Miss Fortune. Yeah, tell me about it. Where are these birds taking me? I have no idea, but you have to do something about it, fast. Alright. Oh! 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 Oh no! Oh no! Throw gl okay, okay, I can kick them in the balls, then they'll drop me. Throw glitter at the birds. I'm gonna throw glitter, I'm gonna throw glitter! Because like, they're around me, so if they experience misfortune, then they'll probably drop me, right? I'm throwing glitter. Okay, my glitter is shiny. What crow is this big anyways? Or is this a raven? And they will get confused and leave me alone. Uh-huh. That sounds like Yes, I like it. I like it. Alright, here I go. Alright. Glitter attack! Glitter! Oh! No! Wait, he was gonna drop me either! This is taking a long time. We didn't even go that high up. Well, time seems to slow down when we are in danger. Am I in danger? What the fuck? A birdie! What? What is that? Uh, that oh. Was a rude bird. oh! I can move. Oh fuck. Should I have grabbed the chicken? Oh. Why didn't I break my legs and die? Mm, you seem very good at falling. What? Thank you. <laughs> the bird was flipping me off. Okay. Alright then, so I guess we're chilling. Is 
the party on the same way to the eternal happiness? Yes, yes it is. Oh, that's convenient. Have you thought about how to break the news to George? About the puppy? Yes, I mean if you want to. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, I like George. Honestly, George is one of my favorite names in the world. Hmm. I got I got to tell him. He deserves to know. Yes, of course. Wait, no. I should be away from people. He's going to be he's something's going to happen to George now. No! I shouldn't have said anything. I shouldn't have said anything. George is gonna fucking die. I'm gonna kill George just like I did his dog. Oh, oh God. What should we do about it? Fuck it, release it. No, no. What if this is a ruse? What if this is a ruse? What if this is a ruse orchestrated by Big Fortune to make me think that releasing it would be the right choice. I'm gonna bring it with me. I'll keep it. His name is Rodrigo, and he needs a new place to stay. Let's go, Rodrigo. I wonder if Rodrigo has heard about sushi. <laughs> it's like Rodrigo put in tiny pieces, you know? <laughs> Wait, if I keep him out of the water, doesn't he die? Fuck! No! Oh my god. It's over, dude. It's over. And here we are. The house of George. I'm a bit nervous about introducing myself. You don't know him? You're fine. You're brave. Telling the truth about the puppy. Yeah. <laughs> Stop it. I'm doing it for the puppy, you know. <laughs> oh my god. Ah. Uh, wait. George's fish is dead too. What? Why? 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 I already struggled to think about the toughest things, and now you make me choose between the two most mundane as well. This game is shit, dude. I'm not playing this anymore. I'm done. I'm done. This is it, bro. This is it. Oh my gosh. You know, fun, fun, fun. thank you for the five gifted. Thank you for the five gifted memberships. Okay. Okay. His fish is dead. So it's very po- and his dog was left at the park. So, it's very possible that George is already dead. George might already be dead. If you're telling me his dog was out there, he never went back to go get it, and his fish is dead, George is probably fucking dead. He's probably long gone. So if that's the case, then if I ring the doorbell, it's more likely that something else might hear me. Perhaps George has another pet that might come to the door. But if it was a dog, he would probably hear me knock or ring the doorbell. It wouldn't really make much of a difference. But if I really want to make sure that I'm heard, then I should ring the bell. Because I feel like, oh wait, no, no, wait, no. If I ring the bell, then it may not work. However, if I choose to knock, what if her misfortune will make the door break and then I'll be able to go into the house and find out if George actually died or not? There's, there's a few outcomes here. There's a few outcomes. Hmm. 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 We're going to knock. Nobody's answering. I'll invite myself in. All right. Time to check out the party. I uh, I don't think okay. I saw a man once floating in the lake, just like this fisher. Hello? 
Ah, oh, what a nice picture. I wish I had a picture like this with my mommy and daddy. Oh! Oh! No! Oh, no! Oh, no! Nothing. I was right? No! She said she saw a man at the lake. Did he take him? Did he take? Did he take himself with his son? Are you sure this is the right house? No. Where is the party? Hello. I was joking. I didn't think I'd be right. No. No. I was kidding. Of a puppy because they bring really bad news. Wait. It looks like he hung himself. Uh, he hung himself like a piñata? Should I hit him like a piñata? No! No, misfortune. He's dead. Dead? But he's wearing a pair of sweet boots. He, he can't be dead. You're right. He's he's fly as fuck. He can't be dead. Oh, oh, oh just go. Leave. Hey, misfortune. I think this party's over. Yeah, we should go. I'll meet you in the back. George, you know, now that you're dead, your puppy is gone. I like the puppy. Bye. Oh, oh fuck, dude. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, shit. Freaking birds, thanks to them, I obviously came late to the party. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, uh, what's this? I guess it's not finished. Ah, uh, no. No. <laughs> Wait. I'm legally obligated. Nice! Well, I brought your doggy back. You're welcome. <laughs> nice. Great job. Okay, I'm here now. <laughs> Let's go into the woods and get that eternal happiness. <laughs> yes. Oh, man. Fuck, dude. I was, I just assumed, I was just like, I saw the fish dead, his dog was still at the park, maybe he's just dead. I didn't think he'd actually be dead. Oh, I love the woods, with the trees and the birds and the animals. Dangerous animals, Miss Fortune. You might run into a fox. A fox? Like Benjamin? Yes. But all foxes are hmm. evil, so keep your eyes open. Uh, all right. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Jesus, dude. This game. Huh? Is that a... Huh. Is that... What's this? Is that one of those dolls that you, like, stick needles in? Yeah, right? I think. Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. <laughs> Alright. Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. <laughs> Alright. A voodoo doll. Hmm. Oh, we're taking this? I'll keep it. I don't even get a choice! What do you have there? Nothing. What? Stay back, Miss Fortune. What is it? A wild, dangerous fox. Wait, I recognize that black tail. It's Benjamin. It doesn't matter. Attack it before it kills you. Uh huh? I don't think Benjamin will kill me. <laughs> Hello, is your name Benjamin? Do what? you want to play with me? What? Oh no, don't go! Oh. <sighs> what a relief. What? We are safe now. Let's keep playing. What is game. he painting? Okay. 
There's a magical cave nearby. You need to find it. What magical is the goal? Cave? Okay. <laughs> <sighs> I'm sick, bro. <sighs> Looks like Benjamin likes to paint. That's pretty cool. I like that in a fox. <laughs> Focus, Miss Fortune. We need to keep going. Oh, okay. Oh my god, dude. Wait. Is that the same thing? Oh. Stargazers, help me. Help me. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Oh, I hope I hope I hope you had a fun time in silence. I hope you were able to be quiet. This game is not okay. This game is so much. Ah, that's putting it lightly. That's putting it very lightly. Oh, God. why are you crying, Manta? Why are you crying, Manta girl? What's going on, Kroshi? What are those tears down your eyes? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know, honestly. <laughs> Maybe I need to be a stargazer right now. I need to gaze towards the stars and not towards this game. This game is actually going to be the death of me. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. I am not okay. I. <laughs> Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> oh gosh. What a time to come in then. Yeah, no, I'm dying. There's just crows everywhere. There's just crows. You think I'd be happy because like, oh, Vantacrow, crows. No, dude, these, this is, these are the death birds. These are the death birds. Beauty, thank you for the five gifted. <sighs> are you for real crying? No. No. Take your time and don't force yourself. <laughs> Thank you. But I'm sorry. Because all I do is force myself to do things. Okay. Alright. Alright. We ball. We ball. We are indeed okay. <laughs> it's okay. But good luck. <laughs> I just hope I continue to be wrong. <laughs> Let's just, let's just, let's just skip to tomorrow. This is, this, this uh, <laughs> I don't sound okay. I'm not. <laughs> it's okay to cry, real men cry. Thank you. I'm doing my best this Kuzu. Thank you for the member. But thank you, Uki. Thank you, stargazers. I, 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 really, I really need some stargazing. It's time to look upwards. Time to be positive. Time to be positive. Little misfortune? Time to put some fortune in her life. Fuck. Oh no, this isn't where his son died, right? No! <laughs> Okay. Oh, it doesn't God. look bad, magical. Just wait until you go inside. <laughs> well, I like the sound of that. Why? I have a question. What's your question? What does this sign mean? Oh, I don't know. Sparkle? Ah, cool. Yo! So, whenever you're ready. Mr. Voice! Wait, I can choose? Why are they making me choose this? No! No! Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We can't trust Mr. Voice anymore. We can't even trust Mr. Voice. Who can we trust? Can I trust all of you? Can I trust? Can I trust you? 
I can trust Dookie. Maybe. Can I trust the Star Agers? Can I trust the Vanta crew? I can't trust Mr. Voice. Okay, so we enter the cave. Or we can stay in the forest. But there's rocks. If we stay in the forest... No, but... He says today she's gonna die. If we do what he wants us to do, isn't that gonna kill her? But, at the same time, Shouldn't we advance the plot? Because if we stay in the forest, and there's rocks... Now I'm wondering. He said, he said the rocks were sparkles. But he wants her to go into the cave. So we should go into the cave. We should go into the cave. The cave is the, cave is the optimal choice. That's the optimal choice. You should do the cave. We should do the cave. The cave is the best choice. Because if we stay in the forest, and we stay under the rock sign, we're probably gonna die. There's also just a fucking dead body here. All right, we're going to the cave. Ah, oh, I can't wait to see the magic inside. <sighs> Police. <gasps> this cave is huge. Echo. <laughs> well, hmm. let's explore the cave. Okay. 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 <laughs> I'm just joking. Huh. There was no echo. It was me. You're a real comedian, Miss Fortune. Thank you. Bunny, thank you for one month. Oh! 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 No. oh. It's like the entry is blocked. Yeah, I can see that. What no, the what? fuck? We should explore deeper into the cave. Yeah, let's do that. What? Bro, what? Oh, no. What? Did I miss something? I'm not sure. All right, fucker. Mr. Voice is a I don't even know what to I don't even know how I feel about him. What's this? A hamster party? A magical hamster party. What the fuck? I know you love parties. <laughs> Do I? <laughs> Can we go inside? I don't know. Let's go find out. Bro, what? This has got to be like, this has got to be some illegal like porn or something like that. There's no way. There's no way. She's like four. What? <gasps> Are you going to do something about it? <laughs> no. No. And the violence between the hamsters? Okay, okay, okay. So, so, I could intervene, but that could result in me getting hurt. However, however, we could just do nothing. Something bad's gonna happen regardless because we're walking by the club. So I say no, I say no, fuck it, dude. Wait, we have the stone though. What if she uses the stone? Hmm. Mm. No, but why would she waste her stone? Cause it's supposed to be a toy, right? So she wouldn't throw it. Okay, no. No, we're not we're not we're not fucking taking any chances. Fuck it. I don't want to get involved in their drama. Let's go! Oh my god, he's a gamer! Let's go! Oh. <laughs> it looks like someone spilled their ketchup. Oh. Oh. All 
Yeah, yeah, catch up. <laughs> oh, are those mints? Bro. Maybe I should try one so I can keep my breath fresh. Hello. I'm a lady, you know? What the fuck? Uh, I'm a hero. I'm a hero. Anything over two months. Thank you. <laughs> We're just gonna keep that? Wait, she took it! No! No! You know what? This is probably the happiest she's gonna feel all day, so, you know? Nice. Oh. Oh shit, never mind. I should just stop talking. I should just stop. Every time I speak, I feel like I just curse everything. Well, that wasn't an empty refreshment at all. <laughs> Are you all right, Miss Fortune? I'm okay. What what even are drugs for hamsters? X X X <laughs> talk about crazy. Excuse me, who the little lady getting inside? No, I'm not very important. You said okay. Can you believe this guy, Mr. Voice? We have to find another way out now. Bro, what? These tiny cutie cars are killing me with their cuteness. <laughs> so cute. Look oh. at them. With their tiny cocktails and their tiny clothing. This is too cute for me. What? You know, I realize now, considering the situation that you grew up in, your perception of cute might be a little bit skewed. I understand. Is there nothing I can do? Okay. There's nothing I can do. Alright then. Give me the fuck out, dude. I'm done. I'm gone. Check oh, it's, that lady out. I it's think an old she's lady. In trouble. Oh no. I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club back there. Really? Yes. What? Looks like she was robbed. Oh. I bet it was that hamster with oh. a black mask. Yes, you're right. Oh. Okay. Excuse me. I think I have your purse. Wait, she's got drugs and a Glock in there? Go easy on the mints, though. I tried one and it was a wild ride. Is that for me? <gasps> what is it? Wait, we can't go in there. Nah, That's nah. A reward for returning the bag, a VIP ticket for the club. I get to party inside the club. <laughs> yes, and one step closer to the eternal happiness. <laughs> That's a win-win for me. Bro, what? Wait, is there? There's a button over here. I can't press this yet. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, no. Excuse me. I'm a very VIP. <laughs> Here's my ticket. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, a real party. No. There's nowhere else to go. Wow, we can fit in here. This is so sweet. Is this the VIP floor? Yes, you could say that. Am I allowed to bounce? Of course you are. <laughs> Sweet. Listen, Miss Fortune, you need to find the white rabbit. A white rabbit? Why? Why? Get you closer to the eternal happiness. Okay, I'll find it. Oh, God. Oh, these guys are all juice drinkers. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, I can't leave. No. Uh, you're cute. So cute. Is that strawberry juice? Mmm, yummy. Oh, fuck. Uh, you're cute. Is that strawberry juice? Oh, shit. Excuse me, can you let me through? Hmm, okay. Okay. Oh no, Stony, what are you doing? This is not the time. What is he doing? What's happening? It looks like this hamster challenged Stony to a dance battle. What? No, we don't have time for this. What? I'm sorry, but it's on rock and roll, Stony. <laughs> rock and roll. <laughs> what? Wait, what? Oh shit. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Great. <laughs> You're on fire. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Sweet moves. <laughs> Shake that booty. <laughs> Dance. <laughs> Super. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Great. <laughs> <laughs> Great! <laughs> Sweet move! <laughs> Shake that booty! <laughs> Dude, this feels so out of rhythm! Super! <laughs> I love you! <laughs> Cute! <laughs> Perfect! Sweet! <laughs> Great! You're on fire! This does not feel right! God. This is so stressful. Oh, the screen shaking does not make this easier. I feel drunk. to go please my brain can only take so much of this shit oh my gosh dude oh it's so stressful those moves were awesome i'm so proud of you i'm sorry to interrupt but oh my gosh dude that felt fucking terrible happiness is still out there don't you want it Oh, yes, I really want it. Let's go. Why was that the most stressful thing I've had to do, like, all week? Damn, bro. Get fucked. LMAO. Oh, so cute. Is that sugar? Is that why they're so sweet? Yes. Sure. Uh-huh. Why not? <laughs> Look, the white rabbit. Where? Thought Wait. Yes. Wait, what? The waitress? <laughs> Yeah, no, it did, it wasn't in sync with the music. It felt very off. It was only partially on for the first, like, 15 seconds, and then it just completely went off the rails, and I had to go off of sight. Hey, you, on the other side of the screen, listen, uh -huh. I know it must be hard not knowing much about our little lady's future. Uh -huh. Will misfortune rarely die? If so, how will she die? And when will the evil fox kill her what will she find the eternal happiness i personally hope she does <clears throat> Act me. huh she's coming isn't eternal happiness just another word for death you sick fuck <laughs> oh miss fortune you made it congratulations thank you where are we we're one step closer to the grand prize of eternal happiness great because i'm not allowed to be outside this lake you know don't worry it's not far from here great <laughs> huh is that is that supposed to be her look a missing kid is that me i don't like this 
Maybe I should go back home. Bye. Wait, no. Don't go now, Miss Fortune. I can protect you. Really? Yes. Huh. All right, then. <laughs> I don't trust him. Stop trusting Mr. Voice. Why are these people wearing Hello? ma- That was the one that was missing. It's not us. Oh my god, she's dead. Ugh, smells like bullcrap. Miss Fortune, watch your language. <laughs> okay. Why are they wearing masks? Why? A unis like to get it? <laughs> Very clever, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Thank you. This is terrible. Phantasmagoria. Phantasmagoria is coming to open field? That's so awesome. Maybe we could find time to check it out later. Who knows? Right. Don't play with my feelings now. Let's focus on finding the eternal <sighs> happiness first. Then we'll see. Dude. All right. I'm... I can't wait. <laughs> God. I'm never going to be okay. I'm... I'm... I don't even know how to describe how I'm feeling right now. It's... It's like I have the shakes, but it's like it's like a cringy feeling, but it's not like that kind of cringe, you know? I don't know how to describe it. Like I have this I have eternal like shivers. Look, it's Benjamin from the Hoots in the Woods. <laughs> you know, if you ever want to hang out or something, I'm available. Don't engage with that wild fox. Why? I told you, foxes are dangerous. Let me handle this. Benji, are you a wild, dangerous fox? No, what? Benji, don't go! What? Let wild beast run off. I don't want anything bad happening to you. All right. Bro, this is not okay. Ah, oh, this is Benji's stuff. This is absolutely the best art I have ever seen. It's so personal. I didn't know Benjamin was so creative. Hide your creative? child? That looks like a child has drawn it. What did you just say? Oh, I didn't mean it like that. Huh. Hey, shouldn't we be focusing on finding mm. the prize? I'm focused. Hide your child. Are we going to the park? Yes. Okay. Huh. What? What? Language. Ah. Uh, holy shit! Oh, oh my god! Oh my gosh, dude! What? Boys. <laughs> yes, fortune. Has anyone reached the end of the game and gotten the eternal happiness? Yeah, has anybody? Fess up. Of course. They lived happily ever after. That sounds nice. You know, I want to win this prize for my mommy. I wish I could give her some happiness. My sparkle doesn't work with her. Oh, that's really sweet. Huh. Thank you. Okay. Would you like to try my sparkle? That's not necessary. <laughs> Don't be silly. Here you go. Happiness to Mr. Boys! Oh, well. What? Thank you. Anyway, let's go find the prize and make Hmm, I'm so confused proud. now. Yes. Does does her misfortune only affect crows? Wait. Wait. One second. One second. One second. When we drew the circle on the ground and we walked across the street. We were temporarily transported to another world. Or at least what felt like another world. And it was desolate, barren, and it was a wasteland. So, if the reason crows are dying, and that's it, what it looked like appeared when we drew the circle was there was a giant. There was like a giant creature.
perhaps the giant in the other world. I don't know. Maybe crows are like important to the story. Crows keep appearing around us. Maybe crows have some connection to this other world and to the real world. That's how they keep dying. Maybe the giant's like flicking them out of the air or something and the giant's following us. So that's why crows die whenever we walk around or whenever she walks around. But why doesn't anything, cause I'm wondering like why nothing else is affected. Cause you know, it showed the house burning down and then it showed the satellite falling out of the sky. But so far, the house burning down seems to be the only thing that's like, I don't know, super consistent. The dog died from the branch falling. Hmm. What does this all mean? It says, don't feed the birds. Ah, uh, okay. Huh. Yeah, that's the only thing that makes any kind of sense. Like, why would a satellite fall out of the sky? And why would the crows fall out of the sky? There was that giant creature that looked like it was following us. All we saw was its shadow. We haven't seen the creature, but we definitely saw the shadow of something big following us in the other world. Maybe that's why the crows are falling out. There's a lot of sweet poetry written on the bench. Yeah, poetry. That it's alive and it's eating from you. Sign M. Mm. Mm. Interesting. What do you think? <clears throat> Miss Fortune, do you really need to read those poems? Mm. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, listen to this one. Both hanging too low. No signal. Nice. Where are they hanging from? Oh, look, oh. a drawing of a cat. Come on, Miss Fortune, let's go. All right. Man, you ain't no fun. What the it's fuck? It looks like Kevin's dad. Who's Kevin? He used to sit in the sun box next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. What? Fascinating. Remember that fish you picked up earlier? Oh! Kevin Rodrigo, my fish friend forever? You should give it to the seagull. Oh! Sure it would appreciate some company. Hmm, I guess that maybe that will be a fair thing to maybe do. I guess. Fuck. Oh, shit. Mm. Okay, okay. So. 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 So far, every time we've listened to the voice, he has led us astray. He led us to the cave where we got locked in. They let us to the cave where we got locked in. Then. Then he keeps telling us that the fox is evil, although the fox hasn't really done anything yet. And the fox was drawing that little symbol on the floor. And when we finished it, it created like a force field around us between us and the other world. So I don't know, dude, the fox don't. I'm not going to say that the foxes are good guys, but they seem kind of inconsequential. They don't seem like they're out to hurt us. Especially since they haven't attacked us openly, just like the just like the voice said that that he would. So, I don't know, dude. Hmm. Also, my guy's kind of like drinking his sorrows away. Would he really care about a fish? He's probably going to eat it. And Rodrigo's low-key our friend. Yeah, we're going to fucking keep Rodrigo. If you want a fish friend forever, you need to find your own. Rodrigo is my responsibility. Yeah, I'm holding on to him. That's very mature of you, Miss Fortune. I'm keeping it, bitch. The voice, ain't, the voice isn't going to fuck me up, dude. You're not messing me up, dude. Would you like to ride the royal horse of the park? Yes, I would. That sounds very nice. Royal horse, you say? I'm a little princess, you know. Wait, it's probably gonna break! I'm on the horse. Oh. Hi, horsey, stop it. Oh. oh. Okay, that's fine. Ah, uh, that was unfortunate. Aha, <laughs> you get it. Right. I'm okay. Are you worried because I'm such a little lady? Of course. You are really <sighs> tiny and you could break. 
I broke my arm once. So, you know what I mean. <laughs> okay. How unfortunate. You get it? Because she's a little misfortune. <laughs> Check out that duck. Let's just go, Miss Fortune. You don't want to get involved with ducks. <laughs> don't be silly. Ducks are pretty cool. Yeah, and ducks look, are pretty he's sick. Carrying a boombox. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for real. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Of course. Check this out. Check me out. <laughs> no! Unfortunate. What are Fuck. you talking about? That was normal. Oh, if you say so. Bruh. Mind your fucking mind your fucking joint, bro. Dude. Would you like to write <sighs> this one? It's like a tornado. Dude, I don't I don't know what I want to ride anymore. She just keeps getting hurt. I don't want to interact with anything. But fuck it, why not? Yes, I want to ride. My god, stop! Ah, I can't hold that anymore. Ah! Oh. <laughs> oh no, Miss Fortune. Are you laughing at her? You fucking bitch. Oh, the voodoo doll. Oh, there's another one! When the trees are naked, when the wind is cold, when the smell of rotten apple smashes against the stone. When the trees are naked, when the wind is cold, when the smell of rotten apples smashes against the stone. Mmm, apple pie. What are you what? talking about, Miss Fortune? Nothing. I can't, I don't even know what's going on anymore, bro. I feel like sometimes I'm just as bewildered as the voice, and at other times I, I want to sock Mr. Voice out for doing what he's doing to her. This looks like the art of Benjamin, don't you think? I think it's garbage, and it should be erased with fire. Hide well, your children. I see great potential here. He's obviously very artistic. Just ignore it. Let's keep playing my game. Nah, bro. The prize is closer than you think. Nah. Oh, really? All right. Nah. Nah. The voice is evil, bro. Uh, I can almost feel the eternal happiness. Good. The Hide your children again. Awaits at the pet cemetery. A the pet cemetery? That sounds like the best place to end the game. Exactly. What? I'm the... glad you feel the same way. <laughs> The Pet Cemetery? I've seen that movie. There's nothing good about a pet cemetery. So, I was thinking while we're walking, mind if I ask you a couple of questions? Sure. Hmm. I'm pretty good at answering questions. Okay. Great. Just answer as honestly as you can. All right. First question. Have you ever stolen anything? I don't know. I... 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 Have we? I don't... I have no idea. Is it asking me? Or is it asking her? I mean... I, no, I haven't stole anything. I, I don't know if I'm supposed... If I, if I, am I talking for myself or am I talking for her? I... I'm not... Not from... Not from memory, no. I don't think I have. No, never. Never? Good for you. Second question. Are you happy right now? Fuck no. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> He's a tyrant and he's never stolen. Sorry. It's not stealing if it's yours. <laughs> no, I'm not. Well, not really. 
Many things make me sad. That's why I want the prize so much. Then I can stop pretending I'm always happy. Ah, I see. Well then, the last question. Do you feel loved? Fuck. Loved? By who? Fuck no. Well, he's not talking to me. He's talking to her. From my perspective in this game, no. I don't feel loved. By her parents? Her? Do you think her parents love her? What kind of sick love are you talking about? What? Her mom loves her. I don't get it, dude. Wait, okay, now I'm confused. Am I answering for myself or am I answering for her? You know what? Yeah, she's, she's, she's got, she's got, she's got stuff. Sure mommy loves me because she hasn't left me. Thank That's you so sick, dude. Your honesty. You're welcome. <laughs> Look. We arrived at the pet cemetery. I'm done, bro. I'm done. You guys giving me all this unnecessary anxiety. I just need to stop looking at shit. I'm done, though. God, these drawings. Ready to find the prize of eternal happiness. Yes, what is it? I have hidden it. In one of the graves. I have to dig in a grave? Oh, God. Which one? I'll give you a hint. It's where the goldfish is buried. What goldfish? The goldfish. All right. Must I dig with my tiny hands? Yikes forever. No. Use the shovel. What shovel? This shovel. Oh, my God. He's Satan. Mr. Voice is Satan. Ah, that shovel. Okay. Wait, what if she has protection from the other world and... Oh, <gasps> wait! Ooh, wait, 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 He just summoned that shovel out of the ground. He told, he told us not to mess with the foxes and the foxes were able to paint that thing on the ground and the thing on the ground formed a force field that protected us from the outside world in the other world, the, the wasteland world. <gasps> He's the demon! He's the big guy that's following us. The big guy that's like, that, that took big steps when we went to the other world. There was a big ass shadow that was following us and it was taking big chunky steps. It's him. It's him. He's trying to, he's trying to break us into the other world so he can take us, so he can eat us. That's what he's trying to do. That's what his goal is. That's what his goal is. That's what he's doing. That's what he's doing. He's, he's the giant. He's the giant. It's gotta be him. This one step. Denise died surrounded by her loved ones in a fire. <laughs> Think about it. It has to be him because he's 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 taking the place of a narrator. But the thing is, is that he's aware of our existence. He knows that we exist and he doesn't have all the answers. He's not an omniscient narrator. He doesn't know what's going to happen before it happens. He's not illustrating every event as it comes up. He's just telling her what to do and giving suggestions. She doesn't actually have to listen to him. It's him. He's the demon. It's actually him. It's gotta be. It's fucking gotta be, dude. Dig this grave? Sure. Why not? No. No. Fuck it. I'm not digging any graves. No. No. Nah. Where's the goldfish? Huh. <sighs> thank you for two months. I'm buggy. Thank you for the five gifted. Thank you so much. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, no. So clearly we have some form of protection. That's why, that's why he believes that she's going to die. Also, you know what else is, you know what else is super fishy? He said, he was, he, he addressed us at one point in the middle of the story and said, I know it must be concerning not knowing her outcome. Will she die? Will she live? And if she does die, how will she die and when? He doesn't know the answer. He just knows that he wants her to. His plan is to do something to her. He's going to harm her. 
It's him. He's the fucking giant. He's trying to break through into this world or get her to come into his world so that he can eat her. It's over, bro. It's over. I don't I, I don't know what this is. Okay, let's see. Little Lulu, the first bug to ever strangle a man. <laughs> no. No, wait, wait, wait. But... No, I don't think... But... Hmm... Okay. He wants us to dig up the fish. The fish clearly has something that he needs to get to her. So maybe we dig up something else. Perhaps there's motifs that I haven't noticed. That would hmm. lead me to being protected. Stephanie Quinn, writer of the erotic novel, Confessions of a Cat. What the hmm. fuck? Erotic novel? Talk about hmm. crazy. No. <laughs> Nah, this is obviously a cat. What? It says, Paul died doing what he loved. It's in Pooh. Yeah, yikes forever. Hmm. Nah, I don't think so. Hmm, what's this? Ah, let's see. Roger the Magpie. Never saw that window coming. Ha, huh. I don't get it. Roger the magpie. Nah, I don't think so. I'll keep looking. It says, Mr. Mr. Bubbles. Bubbles. Hmm. Nah, too little information. Hmm. Hmm. Why don't I just dig them all up? One said, Denise died surrounded by her loved ones in a fire. <laughs> That's awful. Holy shit. Nah. Denise died surrounded by her loved ones in a fire. I'm, aw I'm aware of what it is. I'm aware. Where are you going? The graves are waiting for you. Oh, really? I'm such a rude little look. I'm aware that it's bubbles. It's obvious that it's Bubbles. You name a fish, Bubbles. The thing is that I'm wondering if there's some little clue on each of the gravestones where I can open it up and see if there's some way to protect myself. Part of me just wants to see what happens if I dig up a grave that's not the goldfish, though. I'm just gonna see. This one said, Denise died so... Smells like hot dog. Mm. I guess it's not the fish. Okay. So is there any okay. is there any Let's reason? Say, little Lulu, the first bug to ever strangle a man. <laughs> oh. Let's just get them all. Fuck it, dude. Uh nothing. Nothing. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Erotic. Erotic novels. Okay. Let's see. Ah, uh, no prize. How's the grave digging going, Miss Fortune? Good, I got this. Mm. It says, Paul died. Yeah, yikes for Yikes forever. He died eating his own poo. Ah, uh, no prize in here. Just a bunch of little bones. Okay, so there's quite literally no reason. What about this one? Uh, this one looks special. Yes, Roger the magpie. Never saw that window coming. Ha. Huh. I don't get it. Come on. Ah, uh, no problem. Fuck! Damn it! Okay, so it's it's just bubbles. It says, Mr. Bubbles. Hmm. Damn it, dude. Congratulations, Miss Fortune. You found mm. the prize. Oh, I, really? I got a steam achievement yes. or steam you trophy the little box open for opening them all up. <laughs> okay. Exciting. Mmm, eternal happiness. Is this the prize? But there's only a note. What? Yes, it says, "I stole your eternal huh. happiness." Sign, 
Benjamin. He didn't. Mm. My eternal happiness. I knew the fox was trouble. He stole your prize. What a disappointment. I really wanted to surprise mommy with the... Wait. What should I do now? We must find the fox and get your happiness back. I'm sure he hasn't gone far away. Let's go find him. Yes, let's do that. Ah, oh, such a letdown. Bro, there's no fucking way. Can I read the note again? I can't read it again? Okay. Okay, maybe, maybe I'm stupid. My dude, you know, like, okay. No, no, no hate to you, little misfortune. You know, clearly you like Benjamin, and you know you you, you want to support him and all his and all his desires. But I'm gonna be real though, based on his drawings, there's no fucking way, dude wrote that. There's no fucking way. He's turning us against Benjamin, whether he wrote it or not. There's no fucking way. Benjamin hasn't done anything to us all game. Look, oh, he's right here. Benjamin, he's at the seat of the crime. <gasps> come on, Benjamin. Give me okay. my happiness. Come on, bro. Run come on. Come on. Come on. Can't let the oh, I got the sticky keys. No. He stole your prize. Benjamin really disappointed me. Don't believe the voice. The voice is a liar. When unloved children in darkness search for what they have lost, for why they're in pain. When unloved children in darkness search for what they have lost, for why they're in pain. Let's fucking go, children dude. Children in pain? Oh. Did you find something, Miss Fortune? Nah, you're imagining things. Yeah, I agree. I, I totally agree. Benjamin can't fucking write. You see the, the way he wrote hide, hide your children? Also, why would he do something nice like say hide your children? What would be his reasoning? Why would he start digging in graves? He has no reason to do that. He's a helpful person. He's trying to protect us from Mr. Voice. He's trying to protect us from Mr. Voice, dude. Benjamin is actually a gamer. Our eyes open in case we see the fox. They know how to hide. All right. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, shake out this stone. It's different from regular stones, I'm telling you. I think you're right. The game of death is what feeds the shadows of the bay. Oh shit. Huh. There it is. What does this mean? That looks like nonsense to me, Miss Fortune. Huh, really? Maybe there's some more nonsense around. Oh, this piece is loose. I'll take it no. for me. Maybe it works somewhere else. Oh, okay. Oh shit. I'll put it back. Oh, I'll take it back. I'll take it back. <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm out. There's this. That didn't even look like it was legible. How can she read that? Oh, I keep sticky keys. Aha, that, that hole looks very much like where the fox <sighs> will hide the prize. You mean I should go down there? Yes, don't worry. Nothing bad will happen. Nothing bad at all. Okay. You sound very sure. I'll trust you. I wonder why Benjamin will steal my prize. Maybe he's not happy himself. Oh, but God. I need that happiness myself. And for mommy. Hello? Anybody no. down there? She's gonna get pushed down, isn't she? <laughs> no! No! <sighs> Oh, that was a pretty big fall. Uh. <laughs> Hello? Mr. Voice, are you there? Oh, shit. Sweet, I found a needle in a haystack. Oh, damn. I dropped it. Oh. What? What? 
Fox repellent? No, fuck it. It looks like there's somebody else behind us. Hello? Maybe I'll just Fox take repellent? it. I can't deny the bottle sweet style. I'll take it. Okay, we grab it. Oh. oh, there you are. Where's the fox what going? What are you doing? Benjamin? Oh, shit. What? No. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, dude. Huh. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh my gosh. Okay. 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 Think. 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 Why would we use repellent on the on Benjamin? Why would we use it? The voice is definitely a liar. And the moment we fell in the hole, dude is oddly not present anymore. Maybe he really is the shadow. He's the big giant that's in the other world. So far, Benjamin's been really inconsequential. He's been writing shit around, hide your kids. He's been writing, hide your kids. He's not hurt us just like just like Mr. Voice said that he would. And now he's locked himself behind this. However, we're also in his territory. But he looks really harmless. So like why would he attack us? Maybe he's just going to help us. No. Benjamin. Oh fuck. What have I gotten myself into? What? She's such a mess. Maybe it was a mistake choosing her for this. I mean, I saw her eating glitter. Who does that? Mr. Voice. Natural. I knew it. Uh. I knew it. Miss Fortune, you're alive and well. That's great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where am I? <sighs> what happened? The dangerous fox attacked you. Benjamin attacked me? Nah, he didn't attack so us. He really is a bad fox. He stopped See, us. I he saved you. us. That fox is evil. Mm -mm, no. Yeah, no. Don't listen, listen to to you. Don't listen to him. Don't listen to him. still need to find a fox and take back the eternal happiness. Maybe nah. we could find out where he lives. No. Yes. Give me a minute to figure this out and I'll get back to you. You fucking okay, bitch. I'll just hang around. No, don't hang around. Don't hang around. We gotta... Okay, really quick, before we do that. Hey, guys, I'm gonna do something really different, okay? It's probably not gonna feel right. Your orientation's gonna be all thrown off. You ready for this? You ready for this? Man, this feels weird. <laughs> hey. Okay. Okay. Open Fields Blade is on fire. Local artist retires after incident. My son is missing. Let's see what's new. Let's see what's new. 1993, bird invasion. Well, the zoo, you know, with the animals? Yeah, with the animals. I actually made a quick Google search. I found out the fox has a cousin in the zoo. Oh, really? We could go and see if 
He knows where the fox lives. But how do we get to the zoo? It's like really far away. Why, we take the bus, of course. There should be a bus stop nearby. Ah, uh, okay. This is a different Vanta. It's a new Vanta. <sighs> Open fields. Huh. How did I get to the town center? I carried you here. But Wait. How? You're just a voice in my head. <laughs> just a voice? No, I can do See? more than that. See? He's know. evil. I don't need to prove anything to you. Whatever you it's say, him. Mr. Voice. Fine. You really want to see what I can do? Uh, wait, my shoe wife. There. Did you see? I'm not just a voice in your head, Miss Fortune. Oh, what? Did you see? I'm sorry. I had a shoelace problem. <sighs> oh, my Let's God. Going then. I'm telling you, he's got to be the giant that's following her around. He's the big guy. Hi, you look familiar. All these missing kids. What? He's taking kids. That's what's going on. The fox is protecting everyone. He's saying hide your kids because I don't know who he is. Maybe he's like the devil or something. That's why. A minute. Is that Daniela Bambini? You know this child? Yes, from school. She told our teacher to shove the homework up his butt. She's very Italian, you know. <laughs> she probably what? ran away from home. She will turn up soon. You think so? Yes. See? Okay. You see what I'm saying? You see this? Like, what reason does he have to say that? He has he hasn't ever comforted her in the past. Why would he care? You know, if he really didn't know, he wouldn't say anything. You don't, you don't provide an explanation for something unless you have some guilt. It's got to be him. He's doing it. Mr. Voice is doing it. Like if he, like if he didn't know who she was or had no idea what was going on, for what reason, what possible reason would he go? Oh, she probably ran away from home. You know, like why? He has no reason to say that. It's not like he did anything, right? Or did he? Picture looks so happy drinking their use. Their use, their use. Mommy brings me here all the time. It's really boring. Oh my god, is, is Sometimes that... <laughs> she sends me to buy cigarettes while she hugs strangers by the dumpster. What the fuck? So? Uh, mm -hmm. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> while she hugs strangers by the dumpster? The dumpster? dropped his wallet what do you want to do return it return it we don't steal wait sir you dropped your wallet huh oh fuck you dropped something else one time mommy took me here and forgot me i got to play inside all night until a security man found me Bro, he thought what? i was the raccoon <laughs> Well, that sounds like it was a fun night for you. Yeah, except for me crying a lot, but it was fun. Yeah, you know, this makes a lot more sense. I realize now, the way he's talking to us is like that very condescending tone. Except, he sounds like, he sounds like an adult that's really fed up with the, with, with the kid's shit. And he's just like, okay, yeah, that's very fun. Now let's move on. Oh my god. The evidence just keeps adding on. Oh, thank you. Well, have a look. Is it a winner? <laughs> Cindy, thank you for the 10 gifted. Thank you so much. Oh. Uh, no win. No win. Maybe next time. Hmm. What are all these masks for? That's the real question. It says, let's face it. Sometimes we're just too tired to smile. Use happy face and stop pretending. <laughs> okay. 
Yo, low key, low key. If somebody made this and it was actually convincing, I think this would actually be a pretty successful brand in the real world. <laughs> as sad as that is. I know who owns this store. Who is it? Casey's dad. <laughs> Who's Casey? A friend from school. Haven't seen him for a while though. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait. She's been seeing the ghost of all these missing kids. Is here So Hero must have been another missing kid if Hero was a ghost. Look, even more missing children posters. So many. I wonder what they're missing. Oh, don't you worry about them. I'm sure they will all turn up one day. You think so? Of course. I don't know, Mr. Voice. This is starting to smell mysterious. Oh, <gasps> wait. Maybe the reason why that dad hung himself was because his son, he lost his son. His son was a ghost outside of outside of the house. Maybe he lost his son and he felt like it was his fault. We'll never know why, though. Here we are. Have you mm. ever taken the bus all by yourself before? No, I haven't. I'm not sure what to do. do I so many ticket? missing kids. Let's find out. There's an information board. Oh. Ah, look. We have to wait two minutes. Oh, LMAO. Yikes forever. Yikes forever. I to meet Benjamin's cousin at the zoo. I'm gonna tell how badly Benjamin behaved and that Benjamin should be ashamed. That sounds great. <laughs> it says that all children under 15 years old can ride the bus for free. On God, on God? So I'm good. Great. She's eight! Mm. That I think about it. Maybe you need a bus ticket. You sound old. Uh, I'm definitely older, but nobody can see me. Ah, uh, okay. Are you like 20? Yes, more or less. Ah. Uh. Interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. Check this out. That street is called Dickens Road. <laughs> Got it? Dickens Road. <laughs> Dick. Misfortune. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Why did you take me to the sky with your friends? So you know, because of you, I can make to the party. Bro, what? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Well, you know, honestly, a little misfortune and I could get along. Low key, she's kind of my spirit animal. I said it already, but like, I didn't realize it was going to be this real. Should I sit down and wait? Do as you please. Okay, thank you. I'll sit. I'm a bit tired from all the walking, you know. I can imagine. You have very small feet. <laughs> yes, I'm a little lady. That's what I am. Check those old ladies out. They're a little scary, don't you think? Honestly, I've seen worse. Really? Really? Yes. You know, my mommy also uses the same mask. Really? She likes to hide her smile and tears behind it. Oh, damn. Would you like to have a mask like that? Nah, uh, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. The bus is here. This bus trip might take a while. Are you okay with that? It's okay. Hiro is keeping me company. Oh shit! Oh no! He's my friend from Japan. Hiro's he here. Ghost, you know. <gasps> He's always saying, "Kiri wa doko desu ka." <laughs> you are really funny. Kiri wa doko desu ka? There is no such thing Kiri. as a ghost. Who's Kiri? Kiri wa doko desu ka? Hey, misfortune. Look, there's a bunch of cows. Who's Kiri? Field. I love cows. Kiri, who's that? Oh, that's so cute. 
And what is Kiri? Kiri means fog? Oh, fuck! Oh! Oh, shit! He just projectile shot on that other cow's face! Whoa! I think we're getting close to the zoo now. Okay, great. Oh. Wait! The bus driver wasn't wearing a mask! Hmm. I can't wait to go inside. Why? You have the ticket, right? What ticket? Oh? Didn't I give you a ticket? Earlier? No, you what? didn't, Mr. Voice. No, you didn't. Oh, dear. I'm sorry. I totally forgot. Do you have any ideas on how to get inside? You know, without paying. Hmm. I saw Mommy showing her boobies to the guy in the store, and she got some free food. But I haven't got any titties yet, so... That might not work. I see. Well, I have an idea. What if we use diversion? Hmm. What does di diversion mean? Well, make the cashier look somewhere else, you know. Fool him. Okay. Let me think what I can do. Fuck, dude. Am I good? No, I am not good. I am not good. I'm not okay. I'm not. I'm not. And I'm sorry if I've given you the appearance that I'm okay, because I'm not. I haven't been okay since we started playing this motherfucking game. What is going on, bro? Holy shit. Like, it'd be. I was already shocked when she said, you know, her mom pulled up her shirt to get free food. But then she followed it up with, I don't have any titties yet though, so I can't do that. Like, bro, what? <gasps> a wolf. Can I pet the wolf? He looks really sweet. <sighs> Just wait and see, Miss Fortune. Dude, my, my heart I'm is so heavy playing this game. <laughs> okay, I'll wait and then I'll see. My, my heart is so fucking heavy playing this game, dude. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> Nothing. Deep breaths. <sighs> okay, this is breakable, like like with a rock or something. <gasps> like Stony. Like a stone. No, Stony. Any tickets to the zoo? Ew, yucky. No tickets. Only yucky. Hello. Can I get inside for free? Uh. Huh. I guess not. Oh god, Stony. Do I use anything? Oh, can I pick up a stone on the ground? Over here? Oh. Huh, they know about the missing children here. Huh, they know about... Huh, they know about... Hmm, I think I came up with an idea. Huh? What if... Oh. Oh. Oh my god. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh my god. Oh. <sighs> I don't know. I mean telling a lie is a bit easier. I don't have to break anything. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell a lie. A lie, Miss Fortune. 
Are you sure you want to do this? Yes, I mean, that's the only way to get inside, trust me. All right, let's go. Whoa. Hello, excuse me. There's one of the missing children at the bus stop. <gasps> I just saw her. You may want to go and check it out. No! No! Thank you. You... you... Yes, it worked. What? 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 <laughs> Why? Isn't this wonderful? We'll get to see so many caged oh, animals. Oh, jeez, dude. <laughs> Oh my animal. god. By the way, you did a great job not getting caught by the vendor. Very impressive. Uh, thank you. <laughs> but now, we should find out where the wolf exhibit is. Why? You mean Benjamin's cousin is a wolf? Yes. Remember, he knows where the fox lives. Alright. Uh, okay. Oh man. I actually need to like to stop for a second. Oh wow. Why is this game having such a dramatic effect on me? Holy shit. I don't like this. I don't feel so good, Mr. Stark. I don't feel so good. I don't feel so good, Mr. Stark. I'm not okay. Dude is way too excited to see caged animals, though. Look, birdie mom mom. <laughs> what? What did you just say to me? Give yourself a fuck. Oh, misfortune. Watch that mouth. <laughs> I don't care. This bird is mean. Oh dear. We need to get your happiness back as soon as possible. <gasps> what the fuck, bro? <laughs> Seems pretty smart. It isn't. Trust me. Move on, Miss Fortune. Okay. What caged animal is he trying to see? <gasps> it's the middle finger bird. bird. Don't be. It doesn't know what it's doing. Okay. Fucked. <laughs> Fuck Delius. Fuck Delius, this shitty. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck Dillius, this shit is. Oh my gosh. 40 to 70 years, omnivore, widely spread around the planet. These birds multiply at a very high rate with different partners, leaving behind dysfunctional offspring. They don't care about anything as long as they are occupied by mindless entertainment. Ugh. Thank you, Shadow. Oh gosh. Sending this is a mood cleanser. What is the name of Stony's homeland? Estonia. <laughs> Thank you. Fuck this shittiest. Owl Delucious. Owl Delucious? These owls normally hang near libraries, bookstores, and coffee shops. Although they seem incredibly smart, their huge self centered lifestyle drives them to gather useless information. They live off of attention. Ah. Owl Delucious. I see. Okay. Num num parrot. This kind of parrot lives across the entire world. They talk much, but say very little. They usually work together with human pirates, natural born thieves, founders of the Liberation Fund. Wait, what? Now to catch a stream live. Cataclysm, thank you. And thank you for two months. Thank you so much. Oh, what? What? <laughs> Why? <sighs> so were they for one month? Honestly, it's it's too good of an opportunity to pass up. Take the seeds because I want to feed the birds so they're not hungry. Uh huh. Yeah, let's feed the birds. Can I feed these? Whoa, whoa. Come eat your food. 
What the fuck? You fuck. You just threw it at him. What the fuck? You're, you're evil. Are you going to do the same thing? Go. Mm. Robert and Mary, are you enjoying the food? <laughs> you like it? Bro. Okay, that was just like extra shit. I got an achievement for it. I'll take it. What? So much to see him do. Find so much to do, so much to see. So we what's go, wrong with taking the I back streets? The zoo is about to close. There, you see? That's the wolf thing. Great job. Let's hurry up now. So what's wrong with taking the back streets? You know, I'm feeling really annoyed. Like a lot. Why are you what's annoyed? What's happening to me? I smell hormones waking up inside you. I'm sorry, what, what the fuck did you just say? No. <laughs> hormones. Ah, okay. What's that? Your body is preparing to create your body. <laughs> 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 completely normal. Uh -huh. And you wait for three to five days from your vagina. What the yeah, fuck? Wait, you're just explaining the whole thing to her. Mom, for many, many years, and society will treat you like garbage. Are you for real? Yes, I am. I think I need some emergency glitter. <laughs> Bro, what? Uh, so much better. Bro, what? I mean, I guess he's not wrong, but like, why explain that to her right now? There are coins at the bottom of the fountain. Yes, those are people's wishes. Can one pay for wishes? People nowadays think they can buy everything Ugh. with money. I wish I could do a coin and ask for my happiness back. Also, does Benjamin transform into a good foxy? Because I would totally go out on a date with him. If he was good. Hmm. Are you done here, Miss Fortune? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. I still don't know the benefit I of that, but I'll, I'll keep doing it. So I could send a cute postcard to my friend Hira, but where does a ghost live? Stop lying, Miss Fortune. Ghosts are not real. You're just jealous because you don't have a ghost friend. Yeah, you're just jealous because you don't have friends at all, Mr. Voice. Ah, look at those sweet flashes. They could be all my babies. Don't get too attached to those toys. Don't worry, I'm just looking. Mm. This looks like the way to the wolf. Yes, let's go then. <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. Oh, my. Looks like this area is closed to the public. Bro? Oh, damn it. You will have to sneak past <laughs> the janitor to get to the other side. Don't let her see. She just said, damn Otherwise, it. Otherwise, she will lock you in and call your mommy. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm like a sweet little ninja. I could hide behind those boxes, right? Great idea. Hide behind a box until she turns her back to you. All right, I'm it's ready. Crazy, Let's but I do love this. It. Spooky joke to make you feel better. Why did the zombie take a sick day? He was feeling really rotten. Gumba. Thank you. My pain will never go away, but thank you, Glitter. <laughs> Look, the bear in the picture is sucking a popsicle. <laughs> it looks like it's strawberry flavored. Mmm, yummy. <sighs> what the fuck? Like a little ninja lady. Well done, Miss Fortune. <laughs> what? Now Wait for her to turn her back to you and... And then kill her from behind? What? No. Why? That's what it's a crow! Movies. I've seen, like, all of them. Don't tell mommy. Well, this isn't a movie, so just do as I say. When she turns around, you can jump out and keep moving. Ah, uh, all right then. It just looks a lot cooler on TV. Okay. Oh. 
What the fuck? I'm like the shadow ninja master. She <gasps> never saw me. Don't celebrate just yet. <laughs> There's one more box you have to sneak past. You better watch me when I nail this one. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. I appreciate her being the waste. <laughs> Why is this so funny? Well done. Thank you. I love you, real bro. I don't know what it is about small, just little people falling. It's just the funniest shit ever. I don't know why. We're getting pretty close. Oh, gosh. Fucking... Oh! This one looks like the other one that didn't look like the other ones. You see? Yes. So you know. Yes. <laughs> oh, look. It fit. The path to Sonar City is twisted by the malevolent games from the beyond what a path twisted to where don't pay any what? attention to these silly rocks huh the path to Sonar City it's twisted by the malevolent twisted games from the beyond by the malevolent games from the beyond what a path twisted to where don't pay any attention to these silly rocks Mm. Here we are, and nobody's else coming. Interesting. You really proved your ninja skills back there, Miss Fortune. But I'm pretty sure I was the best at hiding back there. No, you are pretty good at hiding, because you're a bitch. You're not a little lady like me. You're just a boy. Oh, you'll see. I'm much, much more than that. However, now you should go and meet the wolf. Got it. Why? Meet the wolf. Maybe pet it and get Benjamin's address like a ninja. Wait. It's locked. Okay. A key for this. Yes, you do. It says Canis Lupus. Also known as the big bad wolf. His favorite snack is red hooded little girls. That's silly. Remember the what? missing children? Mm-hmm. Maybe he's behind it all. You fucking you bitch! He's eating the children? Who knows? <gasps> You're right. We should call the cops on him. No, we don't want to get involved with the police. Oh, uh, okay. What? Holy shit! Wait, no! I, I was talking about kids! I was talking about kids falling over. Even though it makes me sad, somehow it's funny as fuck. That's all I meant by little people. I wasn't talking about short people in general. Where the fox lives. Uh, we need no. to take it. Uh, I can reach it from here. We need to find a key to open the cage. I'll find that key. You'll see. That's all I meant. I'm sorry if you thought I was talking about just... I don't even consider 5-2 like small. Oh my god. Sticky keys. There could be a key in there. I don't know. Fine then. Let's go and see. Quietly. Quiet. It's like a little ninja. I'm hunting wabbits. Like little lady in his fortune. The ninja lady. <laughs> Shut up. Little ninja lady has entered the room. We need to find a key now. I told you already. I'll find it. You'll see. Watch and learn how to find a key. Oh. Any keys inside the bucket? What accent is this? Nah. It's really cute. No key inside, but you know, these boots are made for walking. And that's just what they'll do. Swedish. Oh. Focus. Okay, okay. I'll check those buckets. Mm. Look, I found a paper with some numbers on it. Keep it. It might be helpful. Okay. Wait, what the fuck? How do you read that? Four, five, six, eight. 
or 5468? Safety rules for handling the big bad wolf. The wolf runs at you ready to attack, and you should not have any regrets about your life because you will probably you will most probably die. What the fuck? Women, people with glasses, and now short people? What's next? What do you mean? Okay. Look, here's the thing. When anybody falls over, it's funny as fuck. But with children, it's especially funny. But then I help them out and feel sorry for them. It says safety rules for handling the big bad wolf. If the wolf runs at you, ready to attack, um, you shall not have any regrets about your life because you will most probably die. <laughs> so if I don't have regrets, the wolf will let me pet it? What? <laughs> Huh, hmm. a secret inside? Fancy. Oh. Wait. Wait. Four, five, six, eight? But there was only four. Is there a key in here? Oh, another doll. When broken oh, hearts one. are chosen, to receive the gift from the beyond. A gift, you say? What's that? Nothing. I wonder what all these dolls actually do. How do I access my stuff? Yeah, this is five numbers, so... I can't even get it right now. Hmm. How do I... Is there a way to access my stuff? Something I missed? Huh? You think we can find some information in here about the key? Oh! I don't see why not. Check out my oh. computer skills. I bet the password is this one. Wait, Miss Fortune. I think you're holding the paper upside down. Don't interrupt me. I know what I'm doing. Keep quiet. Oh! Oh, the whole thing is upside down. I thought that only four and five were upside down. Because I thought that was a six and an eight. But eight is the same way right side up as it is upside down. And six becomes a nine. That's crazy, bro. Eight, nine, four, five. That makes a lot more sense, to be honest with you. Oh. Wait, it was wrong? That's not right? Five, four, nine, eight? Huh? Five, four, six, eight? Oh, yeah. Ms. Okay. Ramirez is a computer scientist. What? You really surprise me. <laughs> a private shot. <laughs> Let's see what it says. What the flip? What? Is that a code? <laughs> Talk about crazy. Who? Why did he just send her a dick? Okay, I don't think I. Oh, well, wait. Okay. <clears throat> Hi. You there? Yeah, I was on the toilet. Yeah, I was in the toilet. <laughs> LOL. OMG, what the fuck? XD. No, ne no need that info. How's that ear infection? Smiley face. It's fine. Super. We can talk about some other- we can talk some other time. Take care. Less than three. Dick. I forgot to tell you uh, about- there's a spare key inside this, the safe. You needed some time. It opens all the doors and cages. Code 27581. <laughs> okay, I don't think I need it at the moment. I already have one, but thanks. Feeling much better today. How's the bear doing? It keeps sucking that popsicle. Is that normal? I'm not sure, but I like to watch. What the fuck? <laughs> LOL, gotta go fix Calvin's cage. Yo, bladder bloat. What the fuck are you doing up to? What? What? You like to watch what? Huh? Bro! 
Why? Okay, so 27581. Oh, my guy's fucking weird. That's... All right, we ball. Yes, I'm the best little ninja lady. I got the key. He just well, randomly uh, sent the girl a dick. Very and for impressive. some reason, he likes looking at the bear suck on a popsicle. Wait, are we just gonna die? The wolf's just gonna kill us. Are you Benjamin Stelzing? You know, that fluffy fox with the most dearest big bull eyes? No? I don't know anyone called Johnny. Who's that? I'm talking about Benjamin. Johnny. He's this sweet looking fox that ended up stealing my happiness. I'm not that into him anymore. Maybe you should stop talking to him and find a way inside the cage, Miss Fortune. Ah, uh, alright. I'll be back, Wolf. And we'll hmm. sort this out about Benjamin. Oh. Okay. Uh, uh huh. Time to meet the wolf. Oh fuck. <laughs> come wolfy, come. <laughs> oh. 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 Uh, I'm a nice person. Woo, woo. Oh. <gasps> wolfy. Oh. Damn it. What scared him away? Oh. Why can't a little lady to spit the wolf? Oh, that was unexpected. Not to me. Animals usually run away from me. That's too bad. Huh. But hey, the note is right there. I'm gonna take it. Okay. All right. Let's take that. We take that. My evil, fo my evil cousin's address. Fox Skogst. Oh, I can't read this. Fifteen open fields. Skogstigan. 15 open fields. Did Mr. Voice want her to die? Why? Well, actually, no, Good. he wants to eat her. Now we can get that stolen happiness back. All right, sweet. It looks like the fastest way to the fox is by boat from Phantasmagoria. Wait a minute. Are you telling me <sighs> we are going to Phantasmagoria? It seems that <sighs> way. Yes. Really? Oh, sweet. I always wanted to go. Yes. <laughs> <sighs> Hi, I like my family. Hi. Are you up for another round of questions while we walk? <sighs> sure. My question answering skills are all warm up. Great. Great. And as oh, usual, gosh. just be honest. Etheria. <laughs> First question. Have you ever heard this question before? What? Kaka! Kaka! Hi, Millie. I hope you had a great stream. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed yourself. <laughs> I, hope, I hope all the family enjoyed this stream, too. This game is doing a number on me. I'm not going to lie to you. I hope no one in chat spoiled you with the game. Well, if they have, I wouldn't know. I can't read. So I'm actually just fine. I don't know what's going on. But right now, though, Right now, I have a couple of theories. I have a couple of prevailing theories. So, based on the way Big Man, Mr. Voice, has talked to us, I'm assuming that he's the big guy that's in the other world that we keep getting transported to by mistake. Whenever we're over, like, a summoning circle, we go to, like, hell, or at least what looks like it, and there's some big monster. I think, I think Mr. Voice is the big guy that's in the other world, and he's trying, he's trying to eat us. He's trying to eat Homegirl. I think I think that Mr. Voice is, is the big giant in the other world. I think that's him so far. That's my that's my working theory. And I think the fox is like some secret helper that's trying to like prevent the kids from being taken by big man, by Mr. Voice. That's my current theory. Have I heard this question before? Yes, I have because I'm used to dealing with bitches like you, Mr. Voice. Yes. All right. Second question. Have you ever lied to a friend? Have I ever lied to a friend? Have I? I mean, I have. I think. I don't remember. 
I'm cooking. This this is this is the dish that I'm cooking. But yeah, that's 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 my working theory right now. I'm pretty sure Mr. Voice is the guy. Because nothing else would explain why wherever she walks, there, there are crows that die, but nothing else bad happens. It's always something like crows. So I'm assuming he's the giant. He's gotta be the big guy. It's gotta be him. Also, he keeps trying to paint the fox as a bad guy, but the fox hasn't done anything to us. Like, you know, he's not even swiper no swipey. He's just chilling. He's just Benjamin. He's jamming. He's been jamming. So, you know, yeah, I'm a traumatized cook. That's the best way to put it. So, yeah, yeah, I'm cooking a bit. But yes, I'm, I'm enjoying it. Also, Millie, crazy thing. I'm playing this game on October 11th. And apparently that's, the, that's, that's today in the game. So, yeah, I'm doing it. I'm doing everything tonight. Um, no, I've never lied to a friend. Yeah, it's October 11th. Whatever you say. It's actually kind of terrifying. Now, for the last question. Have you ever seen someone die? <sighs> yeah, I mean, she has seen someone die, quite literally. I saw Grandad die. It was very calm. Not like in the movies. It was different. I told him to come It's a coincidence. It was scary. Ghost, but he hasn't done it yet. Thank you for what? your honesty again, Miss Fortune. <laughs> You're welcome. We're getting really huh? close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting. Oh, God. You know what? I hope you were more okay than, than me when I was when you were playing this. This game has been messing me up. It's been it's been messing me up. Gosh. Oh gosh. Wow. This looks like the creepiest place to ever exist. So scary. I wish I had a ticket to ride though. Really? But hey, huh. what's that falling just in front of you? Oh. Please don't play with my feelings. It's a it can't be a ticket. It's a bill jet. It looks like a ticket to me. No, that's a bill jet. But I'll check it out. Is that a skeleton? <gasps> Grab <it. sighs> Okay. Huh, all right. We are vibing. But um, uh, thank you again, Millie, for the raid. And uh, family, by the sixth round. I hope you enjoy your stay. Um, I genuinely feel like I'm, I'm, I've, I've worked out. I feel like my body feels weak enough like I've gone through a workout. I don't know why. Even though a tear has yet to come down my, my out of my eye, it has yet to run down my face, I feel drained. Like, I feel so tired right now. No idea why. Couldn't explain it to you. I feel tired. What? A ticket for real? Sweet and spooky. <laughs> Thank you. I've only been glittering You're stuff when the game provides the option. You. Now, let's go find a boat to the fox. Remember? Oh, yeah, see, like, I only glitter when it comes up like this. That's the only time I glitter. Otherwise, I don't really try to just glitter everything. A ghost! Damn, that's creepy. Miss Fortune, please mind your language. Hey, why do you I care? Don't care? It's totally understandable. Why does my that's man even no care? Excuse. Okay. I, I need all the glitter I can get, bro. This is terrifying. This game is awful. Clown? That's creepy. That's creepy. <laughs> Princess, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Oh boy, dude. Oh boy. Oh, balloons. I love balloons. Just so you know that I love balloons. <laughs> okay, Miss Fortune. I love balloons too. I love balloons too. Hey, you, from the other side, uh -huh. Miss Fortune deserves to have a fun time, so try to make the right choices for her, all right? Hey, well, shut the fuck up. You don't tell me what to do, dumb bitch. I'll kill you. Hmm. I just have I'll, I'll make her have a good time because I, I want to, not because you way. suggested I'm gonna it. Look around first. All right. I do whatever I want. And it's certainly not what you tell me to do. Hey, you know, once I saw a documentary on TV about <gasps> hot dogs. Oh, it's just stilts. I don't want to eat hot dogs. Gosh. 
Oh. Sorry about that. I was just trying to pull your leg. If you do it one more time, oh my God. I'll just shut my eyes tight and think nothing. <laughs> I love that dude. <laughs> I'll just close my eyes and act like I don't see it. It's not actually there if I close my eyes. This looks like Benjamin, but creepier and angrier. She said, if you do that again, I'll close my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> More missing posters. Check oh. out those sweet unicorns. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? Oh, no, not yet. Not sure yet. I'm gonna look around more. What's what's all back here first? Is there anything else? Hot dogs. Okay. Alright, we're we're going. Oh. <sighs> Alright. More stilts. Mr. Pumpkin. school say that I have a pumpkin head? I can see the resemblance. The what? Nothing. Huh, okay. Hey, it's okay, Miss Fortune. Some people look at me and they say I look like a hyena. Or a dog. I don't know, dude. There's a lot of stuff happening with me. Ah, oh, the smell of freshly made candy is delightful. Ah, yes. Too bad we can't afford any. There's some candy on the ground. I could use the party hut to make my own mixed candy cone. Come on, Miss Fortune. Don't even think about it. I'm doing it. Ugh. Are you really gonna eat some of it? Wait, what? Oh, dude. The last time we put something in our mouth so we had no business putting it in our mouth, we went on like an acid trip or something. Okay, but here's the thing. She wants to do it. She wants to do it. She wants to do it. It's her. Bacteria. Bacteria schmacteria. She wants to do it. It could be drugs? What? No. Why would it be that? Don't you know that shit's a myth anyways? Why would you give away free stuff like that? Hmm. 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 She also wanted to eat glitter? Oh, that's a good point. Don't eat, don't let kids eat things off the ground. Mm. Mm. She wants to do it, and Mr. Voice says no. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. Of course, it's free candy. Delicious. Oh, 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 fuck. What is this art? Who drew this? What is this art? Why does it look like this? What? There's this, there's cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh shit! Oh no, wait.
What happened? Uh, my heart hurts. What is it, Miss Fortune? I don't know. I think the candy made me feel bad. Oh, well, no. I told you not to eat it. Yeah, that's true. Silly me. Oh, no. Still Miss Fortune. <laughs> oh, much better. Okay, she's chilling. Ugh. No, we're not going in the horror house. Fuck that. She doesn't like getting scared. Let's make her happy. We're we're gonna, we're gonna go we're gonna go on the uh the we're gonna go on this ride. Yes. All right then. Have a pleasant ride. Oh my gosh. What is this cutscene? Soon feel better. <sighs> okay. Good. Good. Now let's go find that boat. What? The boat. <gasps> okay. I'm okay. Okay. So she's all right. I already used my. I can't ride this one. Oh. Hero. Oh, <gasps> hero! Don't go towards the boat! No! Oh, oh my gosh, a bunch dude. Of games here. Can I play one? Oh, of course. You must play one before we leave on the boat. I just love it here, don't you? <laughs> oh, shit. I want to play a game now. This one is free. I want to play it. Oh, okay. please do play it. Play it as much as you want. Really? All right. Well, check this Wait. out. Now with real bullets. Bonsu. What the fuck? Real bullets? I, I think I broke the game. It looks like it. Oh. Bro. Bro! Wait! These are all Fox games! Oh my god. Mr. Voice? I'm not playing that one. Because my mommy never gave me one. So maybe you can give me one. Well, you know we can't afford any, but look! What's that? A floating balloon! Fancy! Fancy! Yes! Okay, <laughs> thank you. Oh! Uh, here's my luck. Oh, Miss Fortune, I'm sorry about the balloon. Don't worry. Thank you anyway. What? No! Sweet, a fortune teller. Can I try this? It looks like you need a reward ticket. Ah, uh, okay. A reward ticket. Sweet, a fortune teller. Can oh. I play this? It looks like you need a reward ticket. Uh, okay. Oh. Oh. Check those sweet rewards. A golden chocolate coin, a cool tiny hat, and a doll. Ah, uh, damn it. I'm kind of low on reward tickets. Oh. Wait, do I get some if I play the games? Check this out. 
that I can get a reward ticket if Poggers. I win. <laughs> I'm gonna play this. Please, okay. go ahead. I can't wait to see what it's about. Are these tiny foxes like Benjamin? They're dangerous foxes. Pretend they all stole your eternal happiness and whack them, whack them. Okay. <laughs> Oops. Oh no, I Fuck. got down. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yes, I won. Can I get another one? Play again? Yes. No, I missed. Wait. No, I missed. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Cut down. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. I didn't win. Fuck. Well, you can try as many times All as right. you want. Okay, I need to get at least four. Oh, Fuck. Nice. Okay. We go again. Nice. Okay. Let's just get all of them. Let's get all of them, dude. I don't know how many we can get. We need at least seven, though, to get a ticket. To guarantee a ticket. Alright, I got the I got the minimum score. I just need the minimum. Let's just knock him the fuck out. Go, go, go. I don't know how many I need in total. Maybe there's more shit besides the ones that I saw. But there was at least three of the gifts in like the vending machine type thing. And then there was the fortune teller. So I know I need at least minimum four. No, I can't! Shut up, don't talk to me! Stupid voice, bitch. I'm just gonna get 10. 10, 10 sounds like a good number. Shit. Okay, I'm good. I'm chilling. Alright, let's go. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you, it's these games that I probably really only like at places like this. Any game that involves chance is fucked, dude. Fuck. I can't fuck up now. I'm gaming. Oh! Oh, you can't get any more? Oh, Pog! Okay, alright, you can get them all. Alright, let's get all these then. Hmm. OK. 
Okay, we got a hat for Stony. That gold and chocolate coin looks delicious. I'll take that. Okay. Oh, one of those dolls again. I want it. Reality most. will transform into what the child desires the most. Huh, really? A desire, you say? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, one second. Transform into what the child desires the most. Huh, really? A desire, you say? Okay. I like desires. I like desires. Choose nothing. Buy everything. That's what I do, baby. Sweet. I want to get my fortune told. Tell her, can I try this? Wait. Yeah, why not? Thank you. <laughs> Once you see the beyond, the beyond sees you. And you can be sure it will be coming for you. <gasps> the beyond is coming for me? <laughs> What's hmm. the beyond? Want to try again? The beyond. Leave. I'm gonna leave. Is there anything else happening here? Wait. Is there anything ahead for me to use it on? There's nothing. Why not? Why not? Yes, Let's get some more fortunes. What you see in the beyond is not what you see, but what you don't see. Oh, really? <laughs> Talk about crazy. Want to try it again then? What you see? Hmm. I don't see why not. Okay, okay, again. You are being lied to at this very moment. <gasps> trust me, me, me. Don't trust anything. Oh, really? Who is lying to me? Is Benjamin lying to me? <gasps> What? What the fuck? Oh no. Too bad. Yes, poor little birdie. Maybe it It's him. It's him. Him. He's been and killing all the crows. He probably threw that one. And crushed that is car. Like this little birdie crushed with its body, you know? Yes, I get it, Miss Fortune. It's still sad. It crushed. Hey, question mark, guys. 
How do you access your, uh, your, your paste bin? It says you need Swan one Lake. golden coin to ride the boat. Huh, okay. It says you need one golden coin to ride the boat. Oh, can you not? Oh, okay. I thought there was a way to. Clipboard, yeah, is that it? Oh, um, okay. I don't know what made me ask about that. I was just curious. <laughs> Check this boat out. It's like a black swan. How cool is that? Really, really cool. Tell me about it. Anyway, this boat will take you where you need to go. You mean to <sighs> Benjamin's house? Yes. And it's just one golden coin. I got the sweet chocolate coin reward. Is that good? I don't think that would... No, see, it's fine. Wait, oh, what? Look at that. Wait, well, why would you get on the boat? Leave? Wait, I just thought about it. We've never tried to deny it. What if, what if, what if it's just an illusion of choice? What happens if I say? We have to move on. Okay, that makes me feel better, feel a lot better about earlier. Okay, all right then. All right then. Okay then. So we have no choice. It's the illusion of choice. We can't actually choose to stay. So, so back then if we had chosen to stay in the forest, it would have just waited. Okay, well that makes me feel a ton better. A ton better. The illusion of choice. Hmm. <sighs> okay. Leave on the boat. We simply have no choice. This is going to be so cool. What? I hope we don't get attacked <laughs> by pirates, though. <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. The Kraken. The Kraken. A Kraken. Well, if you see it, you know. You can't just stop no, going forward. Well, now. we don't have time for that misfortune. Just. I don't know. Uh, but now I'll think about it forever. Uh. The Kraken. The Karen. The the Cra the Kraken. The Crack Karen. Ah, oh, Kraken! If you appear in front of me. I will see you, and if I see you, I will know it is you. Sweet Kraken, come up in front of me right now. Ugh, what's a freaking Kraken? Hey, yeah, what is a Kraken? It's very quiet. Is one allowed to talk? Why is this something we can do thinking, at the park? Is the Kraken available for petting? You know, like. Uh, some pet doggies, some pet kitties. I want to pet the Kraken, if it's possible. Well, I heard you could lure it out with fish. With fish, you say? Look, Rodrigo, we need to talk. I don't know what the Kraken is, but I'm very curious. So I'll just place you here and see what happens. Oh. <gasps> Holy Rodrigo. shit. Holy shit. What is this, the river sticks or something? Why did Rodrigo just die? I think you missed your opportunity. Uh, my luck. Wait, could you have only hit the Kraken if you kept Rodrigo all this time? To the eternal happiness. I've been hearing that all day. It's not my fault. The fox stole it. Ah, uh, yeah, right. Hey, Mysterious, are you taking me now to the house of Benjamin? You know, that blue-eyed, soft, fluffy fox who happens to be a great artist and stole my happiness? A great artist? <laughs> you don't seem to want to talk about it. And why is that you collect coins? That's how you pay for your rent and food, right? Misfortune, just leave him alone. No, he wants to hear. Anyway, 
Do you like to eat sushi? I know about sushi because I have a Japanese ghost friend. By the way, can you speak Japanese? I need some translations. Do you know what this means? Kiribado kudasuka. <gasps> so you don't know? No! Us, you know? The I've fog! I've never been outside <gasps> by myself. Do you go outside by yourself this late every day? Are you going to eat my chocolate coin? Because I'm a bit hungry. Oh my god. Stop talking. Ah, why should I stop talking? Nobody else is talking. Hey, Mr. Is he, where are you going? Is he committing suicide? Oh no, can he swim? Hello? <laughs> what? When little ladies ask too many questions. It makes people want to drown themselves. Ah, stop it. I'm pretty sure he'll be fine. Look, we have arrived. Oh, God. Oh, God, what's going on? Oh, no. <gasps> Check that out. It's the toy graveyard, I'm telling you. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. What time is it? It's getting really dark. Whoa. Mr. Voice, are you there? It was him. Hello? He's the giant. He, it's gotta be. Something wrong here. What? Something very wrong. What's wrong, Mr. Voice? What do you mean? Very it's wrong. Coming. Hide. Hide. I Wait, don't know what? what? You're playing, but if you scare me, I'll close my eyes. <gasps> Hero! Hero? It was Hero! <laughs> Check this out, Stony. This is your family, see? From the woods. Say hello. And now, say bye-bye, baby Stony, because we're leaving. <gasps> oh, damn it. My little foot got stuck. No. Oh. It's the monster, Mr. Voice. Can you see? Can you see it? <gasps> Leave me alone. Go, 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 go. Oh, holy shit. Oh my god. Running away from. Is it the fox? See? He's only talking now that the monsters didn't grab us. It was the fox. No, it's the monster. I saw it again. It's the voice. You know what you're talking about. Yes, I do. I saw it. Oh! <gasps> He's recording it. Don't make any sudden moves. Get up. Get up. Get up. No! Hey, Benjamin! Benjamin! Please, Miss Fortune, stop and listen to me. There's something I need to tell you. No. If you keep running, you'll end up badly hurt, and I don't want that. No. You're too important. But I want to find Benjamin. He was nice to me. Trust me. He's no. Dangerous. You're a liar. Stop running, please. No. I'm keep running. Fuck you, bitch. Oh! Oh! oh. What's this? Really? You don't remember me saying if you keep running, Holy fuck, you'll dude. end up hurt. Uh -huh. I know I could have been more specific. Like, there's a bear trap up ahead. Stop, or you will be hurt. But I felt like getting straight to the point. Okay, okay. Thank you. Who left a bear trap here anyway? I haven't seen any bears. Well, I don't want to point any fingers, but it was obviously the fox. Also, I don't like the fox. I have what you call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes. Foxophobia? So you're foxist. Focus on the eternal happiness again. 
All right. You literally just told us why we shouldn't trust you. You have foxophobia. That doesn't mean we have to. We have to. We have to be afraid of the fox. <laughs> Shad Jesus, thank you for the super. Let's see what this one says. Can't believe you let one of the dogs get out. It's stuck. Huh. The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the band. The elimination oh, of Prime Me. What the will? The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the band. Oh, really? Interesting. Oh, really? Interesting. Ha, huh. thank you, Agarim, for the soup. I appreciate it. Karin, thank you for the gifted. I appreciate it. Gift, arigato gozaimasu. It's stuck. Huh. Oh, so I can't get it out. Okay. The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the beyond. The illumination oh, of Prime Eve will dissolve the filth of the beyond. So does that mean like shedding some light on Prime Eve? Oh, <gasps> the games you enjoy, you can have them all. The games you enjoy, you can have them all. Oh, oh nice. Oh, nice. What are you doing? What is going Nothing. on? Wait, no, there was something else on the ground. No, I didn't pick it up. No. So. Miss Fortune, I have a couple of questions for you. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. Another walk? First question. Do you believe in magic? Do you believe in magic? Uh, sure. Yes, yes, I do. When mommy and daddy scream, I go to my secret hiding spot. And in my secret spot, they never drink juice and never scream at me. That's magical, don't you think? <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, it is, my sweet child. Moving on. Second question. Do you trust <sighs> me? Fuck no. Wait. Hmm. Hmm. What if I big brain? What if I big brain it? What if I big brain it? I gotta say yes. I gotta say yes. If I say yes, then he'll think that I trust him. I'll get on his side. I gotta lie. It's lies of V, baby. It's lies of V. I gotta lie to him. I gotta lie to him. Or, 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 or we don't lie. This is fucking tough, bro. Lies of V. Lies of V. Do we gaslight gate? Do we gaslight gatekeep girl boss, or do we just be straight? Do we just be honest? That's that is the question. To be or not to be. Part of me's like lie because I want him to think that he that he you know we have his trust or that he has our trust. But like Yeah, I'm gonna be real. Yeah, I think we lie here. I'm gonna be honest with you. I think we just lie. Vanta lied, Vanta keep Vanta boss. I can only hear you in my head and I trust my own head. So yeah. That makes me so happy to hear, Miss Fortune. Yeah, well, we're lying. Anyway, now for the third question. Are you afraid of dying? Hmm, is she afraid of dying? Do I? Do I? Am I afraid of dying? I mean, I don't know. She's done some crazy stuff up to now, so we're, we're probably not afraid of death. No, I'm not afraid of death because all, all 
all the people I know never came back from being dead. So it must be pretty cool to be dead. <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out when you die. What the fuck, Looks dude? like there's going to be a storm. Oh no, I hope it doesn't rain that much. I don't like my feet getting wet. I'm a little lady, you know? Hmm. Hey, look at that. I think we're here. Benjamin! Stay cool, Miss Fortune. I'm cool. I'll keep an eye out here while you go inside and look for clues. I'm sure that Fox has hidden the eternal happiness here. Make <gasps> sure the cabin is empty. And if oh, you see fuck. Fox, run. All right. Don't run. Oh, it looks like Benjamin's good at cutting wood. He must be so muscular. <laughs> Why is she so obsessed with this fox, dude? Alright, here we go. Be brave, Miss Fortune. Okay, I will look around. Maybe I can find my eternal happiness. If Benjamin has it, I ask him to share that prize with us, and everything will be fine. Alright. Is this Benjamin? Is this Benjamin's? I wonder. Style. I like it. Whoa, a video player. Fancy. Very fancy. Oh. oh. Let's see. In the woods. Benjamin's on TV? <laughs> oh. Is that the monster? <gasps> Damn it. I broke Benjamin's tape. What? What is that? Maybe I can fix it. Happiness to the video player! <laughs> oh, what okay. a cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? Mmm. Mmm. Ooh. Fuck. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Ooh. I f I can't I can't help but be curious. I really just want to read it. Mmm. Yeah. Yeah, no. This is a no-brainer. I got to know. By Benjamin. By Benjamin Johannalius Redfox. Oh I wow. Knew his name was Benjamin. How did she know? By Benjamin Johannalius Redfox. I knew his name was Benjamin. I must make. I must make Denj dangerous mission. Mission must be done. Is what I trained to make. Nervous, but is okay. I have study and bigger confidence. I travel from Center Center City. We we we've heard of Center, Center City to Pandora when fog appears. Pandora. So Benjamin's not from open field. I bet he has an accent. I love that in a fox. <laughs> I pack things and food. No information on how long stay. I rent cabin until work done. My task important. Boss told me many victims in town. I need courage. <gasps> many victims in town. After long walk in fog, I arrived city called Open Fields. Tiny town was has good forest. Cabin very nice. Has TV, kitchen. I sleep sofa. I decorate cabin. Fish balls smell funny. Ate mushrooms in woods. I refresh after sleep. Try find parasite. Do not find it. Day one I fail. Many victims gone missing in Parasite game. I can't help. Feel sad. I send message to boss. Some victims not coming to center, center city. I see Parasite. It scared me. Also, not eat much more mushrooms. Stomach ache and much gas is no good. Don't eat this mushroom again. Mushroom, serious danger. Not feel good. Danger mushroom. I stay home. Cut wood and do tea and root soup. Good taste. Oh, poor Benji. I do dolls for victims and pictures if she sees them good. Dolls for victims and pictures. If she sees them, good. He's the one that's been making the voodoo dolls. Parasite recognized. Morgo code. Okay. It looks. It, it likes to play. It has guide for steps. Courage tomorrow. Now rest until stomach good. 
Feeling no stomach aches, only gas. I go help missing victims in town. Morgo know I'm here. Morgo play old. Trick many times now. But it makes but it make mistake. One victim can hear its voice inside her head. Oh, <gasps> she's talking about us. Victim code misfortune is nice code. Morgo can't have her say boss. She must be rescued. But I follow steps. I saw Morgo take shape. Scary. <gasps> Morgo is the monster. Boss send me message. Watch victim house. I sleep outside. Hide in trash. I fail find parasite. It did not come today. Big trouble. Misfortune. Watch me. Strange. Why she see me? She big eyes. I run away. Felt warm in stomach maybe. Mushrooms tickle again. I see Morgo play trick again. Victim don't realize all is again. All is again. Must courage and stop parasite this time. All is again? Oh, shake up and you stick. I send many victims to center to center city. I got level two protector. I confident. Now I has primeve <gasps> primeve illumination cave. When when illuminate the illumination of primeve will remove something something bad. So he uses he uses the illumination cane to illuminate primeve, and that will I think what what did it say? What did what did the what did the stone carving say? The illumination of Prime Eve can do something. I forget what it is, but it's it does something good. I try Prime Eve illumination cane in woods. Fun. I feel courage. Practicing to help misfortune. I see she makes too much talk. I think she fun and strong. More confused by charms of misfortune. I did video picking wood and parasite came, but I'm courage now. I scared only a little. Hmm. Yes. Oh. I know how to talk. Oh. On, Remove please. the filth of the beyond. Thank you. The illumination of Prime Eve will remove the filth of the beyond. Oh, he's a good guy, just like we thought. I message boss, I'm doing it today. All steps followed. Prepared breakfast tea, funny feeling with tea. Herbs from the woods are fun. I'm courage and confident today. I ready. If Angie has a boss, he has a job. Then I can be married to him. Nice. Oh my God. Oh, we know the truth now. We know the truth now. Lillian, thank you for the thank you for the member. Welcome to the Venta Crew. It looks like Benjamin likes to educate himself. I He's, like that in a fox. <laughs> the meaning of love when hatred wants to be loved. The fun stories of a boring man. The upside of being a spirit animal. Communication, key to cooperation. Wait, so you're telling me this is the entire time Benjamin hasn't been afraid of us? He just has social anxiety? Bro! <laughs> How relatable! What is this, dude? That's why he keeps running away. Dude just literally was afraid to talk to us. That's insane. Look at that. Benjamin looks so pretty in that hat. <laughs> Shaka chan. Thank you for the member. Memba arigatou gozaimasu. Bentakuru hei yokoso. Yokoso. Benjamin! I'm really sorry I broke your video player, but you stole the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want it back. We can totally share it if you want. Are you oh my God. the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry. You can hold my hand if you want to. Holy shit. What are you? Is this a kiss? Oh is my this God. really happening? Oh my God. What is that? Your diary. I'm sorry if you're upset because I read it, but I was curious. Is it Morgo. the monster in your diary you're afraid of? I think I saw him too. Yeah. You That's the voice. Hide the children. There he is. I knew it. Follow Benjamin. Let's go. Let's go. Are you rescuing me, Benjamin? I knew Maybe it. I was a girl in trouble. I knew it. I fucking knew it, dude. I fucking knew it. I called it. I called it so early. I'm such a gamer. I knew it. I knew it. I freaking knew it. I called that shit out so early. Oh my gosh. Where do you go? Mm, mm. 
Mm, 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 mm. Oh, oh, you like what I'm cooking? You like what I'm putting down? I'm cooking stir fry in the kitchen, and I came out with the five star dish. Five Michelin stars, baby. I don't care if you can only get three. I break the mold. I go past limits. I am the greatest. I'm at the top of the food chain. Vantacro bringer? They call me Vantacro theory bringer because I bring the theories, baby. Oh no, is this Benjamin? <laughs> I'm a chef. They call me Chef There's Vanta. Who behind the painting? Hello? I can't reach it. I'm a little lady, you know. You're telling me a crow fried this rice? <laughs> I can't reach it. I'm a little lady, you know. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna fucking thank you so much for the, for the uh -huh. five gifted. Such a clever little lady. Oh my gosh. Time to use my ninja skills. <laughs> what a bad crook. Be quiet. Bro. <laughs> this is a ninja mission. What? Benjamin, are you here? Bro, what the fuck? I must be like 12 or 6. What the fuck, dude? Oh my gosh, what? <laughs> so it was Benjamin placing these, but Benjamin seems so nice. Maybe he put them for that monster. Oh my gosh, dude. Hmm, kind of fish balls? This is like sushi balls. <sighs> oh my, I don't know what. <laughs> What's up here? Hmm, a picture of a key. Interesting. My ninja senses are telling me to climb up on this chair. Okay. Okay. Hmm, a real ninja lady <sighs> always touches everything. <laughs> a secret oh. button. Oh shit, that probably opens the door, doesn't it? Fuck. All right, then. I push the button. Hopefully it opens the door. Okay. Okay. Oh, no. Is it to the outside world? Eternal happiness. Okay, Miss Fortune. Let's finish this. Get up, Miss okay. Fortune. Let's go. You are stronger than you think. You've been knocked down before. Yeah, come on, you got Did this. you let that stop you? Get up, Miss Fortune. You can do it. Of course because I laughed. It was hilarious. Because... You are the little lady, Miss Fortune. All right. <laughs> Naoki, thank you for the member. Welcome to the Vanta crew. Mm. Okay, I'm out again. Anyone here? Bungie? Mr. Voice? I guess I'm alone. Oh. Oh. A baby deer, so sweet. Oh, mm -hmm. dream come true. <laughs> I'm petting the baby deer. <laughs> Is that Benjamin's bag? Benjamin, are you around? He must be in trouble. <sighs> I'm. Very disappointed oh. in you, Miss Fortune. Holy ah, fuck. There you are. Hey, have you seen Benjamin? I think he's in trouble. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm 
very disappointed in you. Okay? You think I care about what you think? Because I don't. You have lied to me all the time, and that's very sucky. I trusted you. What are you talking about? I read what Benjamin wrote in his diary. All of it. All of it. You're the one taking the children. Yeah, it's you. I, I'm not the hero of this game, right? I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. Nah, you I'm out. Make me. Deuces. Yes, I can. Wait. Stop <gasps> that. Then play with me. You need to find your eternal happiness. I'll give you a clue. It's at home, waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want it anymore. Yeah. I can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. Yeah. I won't tolerate this behavior. I'll be waiting for you at home. No. What? Tell me where Benjamin is. What did you do to him? Holy shit. Freaking monster. Freaking monster. Let's see what's inside. Maybe a clue where to find Benjamin. Darla, thank you for the five gifted memberships. Thank you so much. Gifted Pog. Wait. I pressed X and not down. For students at the University of Center S What? Center Sadis Technology. Protector course. Three-step guide. Three-step guide to exterminate parasitic beings from the beyond. Introduction. As the ultra-reality forms in hand with the concept of time, new realms outside the constituted free five realms of essential existence have appeared. After the Ultra War, thousands of beings were discovered as byproducts of the war. They created, they created for themselves a new realm. We refer to it as the Beyond. The Beyond is, in simple terms, a new place of extreme absurdity with no logical laws of physics. We can't allow such beings inside the free at the moment, since the foundation of our reality is based in the energetic and ethical values of the Ultra Reality. Before the Ultra War, the Beyond is still a misunderstood realm. We haven't yet found the pieces to connect with it in a logical manner. The few patterns we recognize are the behaviors of some visitors, also known as parasites. They normally enter the third reality, aka Pandora, Pandora, that we, that's the second time it's been mentioned, and seek fresh meat to lure into the beyond. Fresh meat is in kids. And that's why we need the protectors. The protectors are the only ones with the capability of seeing the imbalance between realities and using the tools available inside the ultra reality. Protectors will help victims and guide them into center setting. The guidance provided in this book must be followed with great responsibility. Never skip a step. For each victim, the protector returns to center setting. The protector will be rewarded with new levels, tools, and more steps to follow. Step one, the protector must look at the victims and the parasite. Protector's parasite. Well, that's the same code as before. Evaluate if the victim is in need of assistance. If so, then proceed to step two. The victim has forgotten his or her identity. The victim is already dead but doesn't realize it. The victim believes the illusions of the beyond are real. The victim sympathizes with the parasite. The parasite. The parasite. Oh, this is really mysterious. Deforms reality and absurdity. Par Parasite seems friendly, yet it lures the victim to play dangerous games. It shapes us into human animal creature. It quickly learns about the environment, language, and culture. Large flocks of black birds appear near the parasite. These birds are the eyes of Morgo, giving him an overview of his playground. Oh, holy heck, I knew it! I said this! I called it! I mean, not like it wasn't obvious, but like I called it still! I was cooking! I'm cooking so hard! I said, I said the crows were like a motif! Can they go between worlds? There's two worlds, I called it! This was me, I said that! Use the surroundings to help the victim. I like to paint. It's so obvious, but like, oh my, it was so obvious, but like, boy, boy! Use the surroundings to help the victims on the project. You can use, for example, write and say, paint some messages in public spaces to increase awareness. It's, it's strictly forbidden to interact directly with the victim. It can lead to irreversible trauma inside the victim's mind. If the parasite kills the victim, you will need to proceed to step three immediately. Prepare for direct contact with, with... the what? Oh, well, 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 fuck. Never know. Damn it. At the end of the road, you will recognize... You will realize you already signed the deal. I mean, they made it pretty obvious early on. But, like, I still feel pretty good about it. At the end of the road, you will realize you already signed the deal. A deal, you say? A deal. Oh, Yo! Yo! So cute! That's crazy, bro. I feel, I feel like something different. I feel like something different, dude. I feel powerful. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god.
gosh, dude. Is that thing oh, so cute? Okay. Poggers, let's go, dude. Ah, <sighs> bro, this game is something else, though. It does some stuff. Oh gosh. Okay. All right, we ball, baby. We ball. Let's go. Let's go. We're on the way. Get away from the parasite. More go. More go. <laughs> we survive. We ball. Wait, I forgot to glitter. No! Fuck. Alright, I guess I'll take the train back home. Oh shit. Oh my god, it's over. After everything, I fucked it up. I can see what Benjamin tried to warn me about. He knew all along. Such a foxy boy. I can't believe it. After everything, I fucked it up. Just like that. Just like that, I fucked it up. It's over. Okay, I'll wait here. Waiting, waiting. Can I load my for save? A little while. Oh, Oof. fuck, dude. That hurts. Okay, I'm gonna talk to myself. So, Miss Fortune, how have you been? Huh? Okay, I have this, like, weird day. I saw monsters, I saw dolls, I saw Benjamin, and then I went to the zoo and everything what? was everywhere. And then I realized Mr. Voice had lied to me a lot. And he took Benjamin, and now I'm alone. I don't like being alone. Wow, sounds like you had one hell of a day, Miss Fortune. The train is here. It was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You go, girl. <laughs> I'm so done, bro. I can't believe I forgot the glitter. I think I glittered literally fucking everything. I don't think I missed anything. No! I'm quitting the game. Oh my gosh, dude. I can't believe this, bro. Yeah. Where is she? Thank you for the gifted. Fuck, this is hard. Vanta has some creative coloring skills. Shut the fuck up. I'm using WASD and holding spacebar. You can fuck right off with that. Vanta has some interesting coloring skills. Fucking coloring skills, these nuts. I might as well be coloring with my nose at this rate. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Wait, I can use my mouse? Oh my god, I can use my mouse! I could have used it this whole time! You're kidding! I didn't know that I could use my mouse! Bro! This changes the game! Oh my god! Oh, bro! Oh my goodness. That's crazy, dude. Alright, we're coloring. We're coloring. I'm coloring. I'm coloring. <laughs> Can you tell me? 
to breathe easy for a while but breathing gets harder even i know that da -da -da -da. make room for me it's too soon to see <laughs> Dude, am I supposed to be able to color this properly? Cause like this is fucked, bro. Mm. Okay, we ball. Wait, yo, River, I'm oh, you Thank you so much for the five gifted. Margie, thank you for the ten. Holy shit. Where? Where? I don't know where to go. All right, we keep going. I can't believe after everything though, I'm gonna die. After everything I did, I was like perfect all the way through. I can't believe I dropped the ball right at the end. That's so sad. Oh. Oh. Huh. I don't feel inspired. Kisa, thank you for two months. Uh. Hello, Hiro. I didn't recognize you. <laughs> I can't believe it, bro. Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. But I don't think it's a voice anymore. I'm sure it's the monster. I saw it in a book at Benjamin's place. Mm. Really creepy. Have you ever heard voices in your head? Yeah, all the time, actually. I know Hira. What Consequences. It's the monster. Leave Hira alone. Let's get that. Let's go. Help him. Hmm. Fuck. Consequences. Consequences. Be oh, beware of the consequences. Oh, I'm fucked anyways. Hero. Oh, what? What do you mean, how is this a tough decision? I don't know if I'm gonna die, bro. Okay. Alright. Alright, it's not my fault. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay. I guess we... I hope I get to see Hiro again. I wonder what the monster did to him. Uh, huh. Now I have to walk all the way back home alone. This is the last time I follow a voice in my head. If Benjamin was here, he would walk with me. Uh... <laughs> you said... <laughs> she said hold my hand and we grabbed his foot. I'm gonna be real with you. Miss Fortune was kind of attracted to a fox. I think her perception's a bit off. For all we know, it, they're the same thing. You know, honestly, I'm not going to lie to you. So, Vanna's never beating the kids' meal allegations. I'm going to be real. Let's be honest, guys. Like, like, just, just, just stop and think about this for a second. Everybody's talking about the game show with Crisis. Vanta's most likely the one to get the kids' meal, right? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Vanta's, Vanta's so funny. Vanta's not... Vanta's not, uh, you know, he's, 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 his taste, his taste buds aren't as refined. His, his palate is not as, is not as advanced. Bro. Does it look like my ass would be fucking full from a kid's meal? Does it look like that would be damn near enough food for me? From, for my big ass? Do you see me? Do, have you seen me? Do you think I'm ordering from the kid's meal? Who? Who? You think that's you think that's gonna you think that's gonna fill me? Nah, bro. Nah, bro. My standards are higher. My needs are greater. If anything, Wilson would order from the kids' meal. You want that toy right now, though? 
Okay, well, I mean, if it was for the toy, that's a different story. Then I would just get two kids' meals. Benjamin was warning me all the time, but I couldn't see it. I wanted that eternal happiness so bad. I'm a silly little lady. That's what I am. That's different. Ha 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 not the Wilson slander. It's not slander. There's nothing wrong with ordering from the, from the kids' menu. I'm just telling you, there's a pretty valid reason why I wouldn't. At least I had fun at Fantasmagoria. <laughs> I'm gonna tell mommy about it. I can't remember the last time I ordered a kid's meal, actually. I feel like it's been quite some time. I'm proving the point that I would order a kid's meal. I don't know, dude. I feel like I feel like we're assuming that I would be into the toys from a kid's meal. When like the toys only have like two functions. I'm into like Beyblades and shit. You can't get those from from a McDonald's kids meal. Excuse me. I'm talking over here. Well, if that's how you treat little ladies, then give yourself a fuck. <laughs> what? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh wait, we're actually back home. What's gonna happen? You have high standards, then we'll up it to the dollar menu. Okay, all right, all right. That's different now. Upping it to the dollar menu? What's wrong with ordering from the dollar menu? Really? Really? Come on. That's just smart. That's just smart. You're just being economically aware if you're ordering from the dollar menu. Honestly, that's a green flag if you order from the dollar menu. If you're going to McDonald's, you might as well make it cheap, you know? <gasps> Whoa, the light is all red. Is there anything I can run by? We got red lights. I like them. Hmm. Mommy, I'm back. That does Hello. not sound good. Oh, shit. Benji? No! Please! The house is like... Man, the house looks better than fucking ever, dude. Holy shit. Good god. They needed, they needed to re-renovate this motherfucker, so... <gasps> the glass! Mommy? Benji? What happened here? <gasps> Congratulations. You reached the end of my game. Leave me alone. I'm looking for mommy and Benjamin. There's no eternal happiness for you. No! I don't even care anymore. Of course you care. You know your mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. Yes, I guess you're right. Good. Good. Ready for a new game? If I play along, will you give me back Benjamin? I guess I will. But only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. No. 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 Game. No. This is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so no. wonderful family. A little sparkle for you and a little sparkle for you. No. Wait a minute. Okay, thank Didn't God. I do this already? What? No, you're not doing this correctly. Then you say something about me dying today, which is totally not true, by the way. <clears throat> Wait, stop talking, please. <gasps> Are we going to play another game, or is this like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. And then you say deal, and I say yes. Stop ruining this. <laughs> eternal happiness. I love her. Deal. 
Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to... Wait. What? No deal. No. No. Uh, how about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin and you leaving me alone, I'll play along. <laughs> sure. <gasps> sure. I promise. You know the way. Hmm. If Mr. Boy scares me again, I'm gonna run and hide in here. Okay. Alright then. We have our escape plan. I have a little hunch that Mr. Voice is the monster in my closet. Oh, maybe you're right. Huh. Is this a new dance song? Oh. We don't like it. <sighs> okay, I'm just gonna play his game one last time. No! She doesn't dance this time, though. Oh, <gasps> The vase! No! <laughs> was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Ma, you lied to me. I don't want to play this game anymore. Fine. Huh. Let me come up with a new game to play. Huh. <laughs> new game. Knock, knock. Who's there? No, I don't want to play with you anymore. Damn. Knock, knock. <gasps> Who's there? Yo! You're scaring me, stupid. Leave me alone. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. I gotta go back into the bed. Go back into the bed. Under the bed. What happened here? My secret spot. He won't find me in there. No! 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 Sticky keys! Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Ah, oh, Stumbly, teach me how to be brave. Ah. Oh. Benjamin, so where you at? Benjamin! See. Benjamin, I please! That game. No, leave me alone. All right, just so you know. My game is the only thing keeping you alive. Is that one more of your lies? I will live forever with Benjamin, and what? there's nothing you can do about it. Will you please stop talking about that fox? He's been trying to take you away from me all the time, and his ugly paintings. Ugh. Oh no, you don't talk like that about my Benjamin. You know what? I'm done with you. I want you to leave. Right now. Get out. You don't have a clue about what's going on. This is not the last game you play with me, Miss Fortune. This is only the beginning. <gasps> Holy shit. You no, Morgo! Oh my god, he's a ugly. Toy for my collection. What the fuck? You're mine to play with for eternity. I'm sick of you being a bully. <laughs> You'll see, Benjamin will come back and save me. No, we made a deal. You crossed the path, and now you're mine. <gasps> Let's go, Benjamin! She went. He waved back. How did you get here? There's nothing you can do. She belongs to me. <laughs> what? What is he doing? Oh, damn, one shot. Oh, my God. Let's go, Benjamin. 
Let's go! Oh my god. Holy heck, dude. What? Is she gonna live happily ever after with Benjamin? Oh. Wait, so I still- Wait, she still survived. Wait, so- What the fuck? You fuckers lied to me! Who said I- Who said I locked myself out of the good ending? To normal now? Benjamin saved me. Benji, are you around? I guess I have to rebuild this. I'll make some improvements. But first, I want to thank Benjamin. Mogo is coming. Open your eyes. He's the voice in your head driving you mad. <gasps> what? Mogo is coming. Open your eyes. He's the voice in your head driving you mad. Oh, fuck. Well, now I know what to call Mr. Voice. Benjamin, did you go outside? Benjamin, where are you? Oh, fuck. Oh, is our mom here? Oh, fuck. No, she's not. And it's still October 11th. It's 11.58 p.m. Let's go. It's still October 11th where I'm at. Let's go, baby. Oh, no. What happened? Mommy. I'm back. We don't know that we're dead. No! Mommy, no! Ignore me. Are you angry because I couldn't get the happiness for you? What's happening? Mommy? No! <laughs> this must be a bad dream. Are you kidding me, dude? Are you joking? What have I done? Wait, when did this happen? Wait, was she always dead from the beginning? Her mom never reacted to her mom never reacted to her. Oh, thank when she you. said bye mom, I'm gonna go play. I thought I lost you too. She was dead the whole time! She was what? dead literally from the beginning! What's happening? Oh my god! That was one of the things. That was one of Benjamin's jobs. Oh my god. If the person is dead but they don't know it. She was always dead. She just didn't know. No. There was never a good ending. There was never a good ending. No. Benji, wait. Are you taking me somewhere else? Because I have nothing against it. But I have to talk with my mommy first. Holy shit. Mommy, I'm going to go somewhere else. With Benji, okay? He's the fox that I like. I'm a little lady, you know? That's what I am. It was her dad. I guess I was your little misfortune for a while. That's why she has the mask on. Own happiness now. Because her daughter died. <gasps> I love you forever. No. No.
Maybe that's partially why he was so nervous to talk to us. How do you tell someone that they're actually dead? Especially an eight-year-old! Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Wait, stop, Benjamin. Where are we going? Benji? Oh my god, you're right! He went into our world through that grave! Perhaps? I'm not sure. Benjamin. Oh my god. Wait for me, puppy. Wait. So. Oh my gosh. So, we didn't actually have anything to do with the puppy dying. The puppy just died anyways. Could we really have set it free? Was it all a choice? Was that an illusion? It was on illusion from the beginning? So whether I had picked free the dog or not, the dog would have died. Probably. I had no influence on anything happening around me at all. That's why the wolf didn't react to me or attack me when we went into the cage. She, she didn't exist. She was dead. Holy shit. That's also why we didn't die when we were falling from the sky. That's why she didn't die. She was already dead. Holy fuck. Oh my god. Oh, this place is really cold. Oh my god, dude. The teenagers ignored her. All the adults ignored her. And the guy that dropped his wallet never actually said anything to us. Oh, that hurts so Kidding me, bro. All around disasters seem to disappear. Deep inside the fog, you defeat him. I can't believe it, bro. Literally that All one at the end. Disasters seem to disappear. Deep inside the fog. I'm so depressed. I'm actually so Sorry, depressed. I guess Mr. Boy's game is over now. Benji? <sighs> That's actually so depressing, dude. Is there no saves? Can I not like reload shit? Holy fuck. Who are you? I'm so done, bro. That actually pulled me out of the game. I'm actually That's depressed. I'm actually sad. Lady misfortune? Yes, you could say that. Good. Step inside. Huh. We were expecting you. I I don't even want to play, dude. I'm actually just sad. Oh, jeez, dude. Wow. I just... Oh my gosh, dude. Wait, how do you save? Could you save? Yeah, there was no there was never any option to save. Place. 
Wow. Okay. Well, I guess GG, bro. I'm done, bro. That actually made me so sad. Gosh, you think every one month. Wow, bro. What do I do? Oh my gosh, dude. Huh. I just... Dude. <sighs> <laughs> oh, that hurts so bad, dude. Fuck. It's just an extra lore moment. I know, but I could have got it myself. I could have done it all on my lonesome. I could have done it on my own. I could have saw it in my own game. Yikes forever, bro. Yikes for fucking ever. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh, dude. I just... <sighs> okay. Nade nade. Fran Bao? I've never heard of it. Fran Bo? Didn't you save when she was trapped in the basement? I don't know. Are these are these necessary? Can I skip these? Can I skip these? Nothing's going on. All right, then. Hoggers. Yikes forever, dude. Yikes forever. Hope you enjoyed Little Misfortune. I, I did. It was, it was, it was entertaining, that's for sure. I'll say that for a fact. Wait. I'll watch it later. Uh, that's depressing, dude. That hurts my soul. <sighs> that makes me so sad. Thank you, Nikki, for two months. I, I had a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun. Even though this game fucked me up on a level I never expected it to. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did no one warn me about this game? I mean, they kind of told me about it at the beginning. But like... You know. I just kind of go into shit. I don't really worry about anything. Luckily, I have the memory of a goldfish, so I'll probably forget about the game in like a week. It'll be okay. At least she'll never be sad anymore. True. True. Thank you for the super. 
Yeah, it's super heavy. My heart is heavy as fuck right now, bruh. My heart is heavy as fuck. I'm just dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. So you know what? We're gonna we're gonna vibe. Ha ah, man. That indeed hurts in my soul. I can't believe it. Well, I missed the last glitter, but that's okay. Got through the game. It was nice. It was fun. It was chill. It was it was it was vibes. <sighs> that hurt me, dude. That really hurt me. Huh, <sighs> but I had a lot of fun. Thanks, thanks so much. I'm glad this game this game was wild. Story-wise, I'm just like, I am so messed up. I am so messed up. Sleep is indeed, I, I, I'll be okay. I'll be okay. Hey, you know, at least tomorrow, we have Animal Crossing. If nothing else, Animal Crossing. That's gonna make me feel great. Animal Crossing. You engage with it so deeply. Thank you for all the big brain theory crafting and gamer mo monumental moments. Please don't be sad. Uh, you did very good. Thank you, BD. I appreciate it. Thank you for the shupa. I appreciate it. I'll be all right. This, I don't know. It just makes me sad. I could have gotten the secret ending on my own. First try, you know? First try without any help. Like, that would have been sick. But I can't believe it, dude. I don't know why I didn't think to glitter. Animal Crossing to heal, to heal the heart tomorrow, for sure. <sighs> Gosh. <sighs> I can't believe this. Oh, but it's all right. I game. Animal Crossing tomorrow. Animal Crossing tomorrow. Hi, my name is Trey and I have a basketball game tomorrow. I'm a point guard. I have shoe game. That was funny. I like that. That made me happy. Oh my gosh, dude. What are we gonna do now? Well, I simply, I simply die, I guess. I simply suffer. Um, oh, you know. Oh wait, is there no one streaming? Holy shit. Who's on? Is it just me? Is it just little old me? I'm streaming all by my lonesome? Well, but you know what that means. It's time to make a waiting room and then raid my waiting room. Okay. We're gonna make our Animal Crossing waiting room right now. <laughs> Oh, Zally's in an hour. Oh, true. Guess it's a little misfortunate you couldn't bring her more glitter vents. That misfortunate. <laughs> Unfortunate. Very cool. Fran, Fran Bo. Okay. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you, Meraki. Now, Pocket, thank you so much for the five gifted memberships. Hmm. Animal Quassing. And which one is more harmful, Cherry, the Malone, or Little Lady Misfortune? I don't want to talk about the Malone anymore. I don't want to talk about the Malone. The Malone makes me sad. The, the Malone makes me sad. I will say this. I will say this, though, in case you're curious. I have gotten a Suica quite a few times, if I do say so myself. I've gotten a Suica quite a few times. My score is nothing to write home about, though, but I have gotten several, several Suicas. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not saying what my score is. I refuse. I no, no. Honestly, I may not post it no matter how high I get it. If I'm being real with you. Without us, look, I'm gonna be real with you guys. That that game has absolutely destroyed me. Like I said, I have not enjoyed a single moment of my time playing that game. Not at all. I'm I'm never happy while playing that game. As a matter of fact, it is a it is, it is a net loss in happiness. Whenever I play the game, if if you can calculate serotonin levels with a number, if my serotonin levels are at 10, the moment I turn on Suica, they drop to about three, and then they drop progressively more as I'm playing the game. It is, it is not good. It is not good for me. It's not good for me. The game genuinely just makes me sad. So that's the reason why I don't stream it. I, I, no, I'm... I am a worse person for streaming that game. Worse. I am worse off for streaming it. <sighs> Guess it's your cuss to be you. <laughs> I'm super big for, big for the five gifted. But what if you win? 
when I win, I get I, literally when when I do well, when when something good happens in the game, this is this is what happens, okay? Doing well for one moment in Suica in the watermelon game is literally the equivalent to New Year's. It's the equivalent to New Year's. I'm normal, and then the moment it hits midnight, I go yay, and then I and then I drink my fucking you know like sparkling sparkling apple cider slash champagne, and then once it's 12:01, I drop that shit and I go back to my life. That's literally it. That is what happens. Something good happens in Suica. I just celebrate and then I sit back down. All right. That's it. It goes back down. It rises up to like it, my 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 serotonin levels rise up to about five, and then they drop back down to zero. So yeah, no, no, no. I love I love myself. That's why I don't stream the game. That is precisely why. But it's okay. I did it. All I want to do is get a, a score that I'm happy with, and then once I get a score that I'm happy with, I will quite literally never fucking touch the game ever again in my entire life. But yeah, until that happens, I'm gonna keep playing it. But what if? But what if you're in first place? I'm not in first place, and frankly, I don't give a fuck. I don't care. I don't care about beating my senpai. I don't care about beating my gen mates. I, I I don't care. I just I don't. I just don't. I I literally want to get the watermelon out of my head. That's it. That's it. I just, I just want, I just want it to go away. I want it to stop crowding over my dreams. Whenever I sleep, I think about it. If I can't sleep, I, I pull out my switch and I start playing it. When I, when I'm, when I'm doing my Japanese practice, because you know the Japanese practice is over. It's, it's over. It's, it's a listening exercise. It's 30 minutes. It plays, it plays a tape in my head, and it, and it plays a conversation for me that I have to. It tells me like, oh, why don't you say this? Or what, what does the person say? Uh, they say, what is it? I, non deska. Literally, I'm, do, I'm doing my Japanese practice and I'm playing fucking Suica. So yeah, no, no, no. It's not good. So yeah, but oh, I'm vibing. I'm gaming. It's a good day. I'm happy. I'm gonna do my best. I whip and I dab. I survive. <sighs> boy, oh boy. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. <sighs> but, in better news, Animal Crossing tomorrow. Then, after that, oh my god, then it's Cyberpunk again. And then once Cyberpunk starts, that's the beginning of the end. I will I will start Cyberpunk at 8 p.m. and I won't be going to bed until la, 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 la. more than 12 hours later. But that's pretty normal. My mom loved watching you play Suica. Why? Did she just like feeling better about herself? Was she struggling with the game too? And then she looked at me play and then she was just like, oh my god, I feel so much better. Event is so fucking terrible. Is that why? Is that why? Is that why she liked, is that why she liked watching me play it? Thank you for the super, by the way. My goodness, don't talk shade about someone's mom now. What? That's not shade. I, I'm throwing shade at myself. What do you mean? Why are you taking it as an attack? I'm not! It's a joke! Just laugh! What? Alright, you know what? It's time to go to bed. It's time it's time it's time to go beddy bye. We need we need to lay down. Shoo honk shoo. Yeah, we're done. We're done. It's over. It's over. Little misfortune? No longer is it her. It's me. I'm Mr. Misfortune. I live and I breathe. I whip and I dab. But thank you so much for hanging out for Little Misfortune. Uh, the game really fucked me up. You guys weren't kidding about how heavy this game can be. Uh, so yeah, that is fucking insane. Huh. You're the first streamer I watched out who figured out who figured out who the monster was right away. Really? I figured it out. Wait, wait, really? I feel like it was pretty obvious. Huh.
Well, that means I'm, that means I am kind of a gamer. <laughs> I whip an idea sometimes. I go kind of crazy, you know. I do a little bit of trolling. They call me Vantacro Theory Bringer because I bring the correct theories. I game. I ball. <laughs> I called when we were digging up the graves. Oh really? Oh really? They didn't. Oh. Hmm. Oh. I, I'm still God's silliest experiment. <laughs> That's such a cool title. Whoa. Wonder if I can ask Niji if I can change my title to that. Um. What is it? Could you imagine? It's. I, I'm no. I'm no. Lo I'm no longer the trusted ace of Crisis. I'm. I'm. I'm the silliest experiment of Crisis. <laughs> Oh, it's Ivanta. Thank you, Anna. Thank you for the super. And thank you guys all for the supers and all for all the gifted memberships, too. Holy shit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you being here with me through this game. It was a blast. It was a blast. Hopefully more horror next week. Although, now that I think about it, the first four days of next week are going to be super packed. I hope you guys are okay with that. I hope you guys are really okay with that. Like, Monday through Thursday is going to be fucking packed for me. Like, super crazy packed. So yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be scary, cause cause I'm gonna be away from the 19th to the 23rd. So basically from Thursday to Mon no to Sunday, I come back on Monday and I stream on Monday. So yeah. So I'm gonna be away from like Thursday morning to Sunday, and then I'm coming back on Monday, and then I ball. So yeah, sorry about that. What's happening next week? Oh, oh, it's 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 a personal thing. I, I have to be away. Huh, nothing's happening with anything. I simply will I simply will just be away. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go. Okay, yeah, the game. Will you play Lords of the Fallen? God, that game looks sick as fuck. I'm gonna have to see about it first. I'm gonna have to see. Um, we'll see. We'll see. We shall indeed see. We will see. But thank you so much. I appreciate appreciate it. Any day, thank you for the super. Rose, thank you for two months. Thank you. Thank you for hanging out with me. Yeah, I'm being sent on a long mission. Yes. <laughs> Believe me. Believe me. If, if I, if I, when I, when I say, when I say I would love to just stay here and stream every single day, that would be my wave. But I hope I can make it up. I hope I can make it up to you guys when I get back on that following Monday. But let, that's not for a bit. I'll let you guys will know in advance. You'll see in the schedule. You'll see in the schedule that, uh, what I'm doing. So you'll know. But until then, we go kind of crazy. Okay. Um, there's no one to raid. I'm on, I'm online alone. So, I guess that means we just... Oh, you know what I do? You know what I do? Here's, here's what we do. Here's what we do. I lean into the mic. And then I go... And I talk in Italian. Then I... And then I bring my voice up here. And then I go... And then I, and then I bring it back down. And then I go... Ooh, I'm a big scary monster. Um, and then I pull my mic away. And then I sound like I'm far away from my mic. I'm so far away. Whoa. And I bring it back down. And then you guys can barely hear me. You're going to be like, Croce, are you there? And then I'm going to be like, yeah, I'm here. And then I bring it back close to me. And then I dab. Okay. I just wanted to do that. I don't know what I was doing just now. But okay. Thank you, Hoshi. And thank you for the super. All right. We're signing off. Oh, yeah. You're right. I should raid Zally. Morning radio. Morning radio. All right. Hasta la bye bye. I will see you guys tomorrow for A C N H because I have to build houses for people. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. They already have houses. I got a house. I just got to collect more stuff. Okay. Okay. We go crazy. Waiting room will be up soon. Okay. See you later.
Bye bye. Oh yeah, by the way. You're so cool.